It's your boy Paul P. I serve God. I'm not God. This is just my opinion. And welcome to another episode of the Nothing to Some Podcast, the N2S show today. We in a building. We got milk back a, a, a four or five. What is it? Six, six time offender milk? Probably like I'll, I'll just say seven. Because I seven? like seven. Yeah, it's a lucky number. Man. Uh, we be at it, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, coming with something new. You know how you been, oh bro? I've been good. I, I've been feeling good. I got no complaints. I've just been enjoying myself, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's what's up, man. Living life. Yeah, just, um, yeah, just that. That's really it. Just living life and getting ready for my, uh, my little, uh, stepdaughter prime. Just Dope. getting that stuff out of the way. Dope. Yeah, that's, that's pretty much it, really. That's what's up, man. Stepdaughter, how did, so she 18? 17. 17? Well, about to be, no, yeah, 17, about to turn 18. Yeah. Okay, okay. Nice, yeah. nice. Today, we also doing something a little different, man. We got my boy, Big Don, who's in the building today with us. You feel me? What up, Big Don? Show the people who you... Show the people when I say Big Don, who Big Don is. Big Don in the building. <laughs> what up, everybody? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yay, yay. So, yeah, man, Uh, you know, we all in the building. You know, Milk is here, you know, and everything like that. Um, You know, we was talking about something before we get into some stuff. We was talking about something earlier, and I, and I want to speak on that because it is something that's important, especially when it comes down to to where we at out here in L.A. You know, uh, you know, a lot of overdoses and thing like things like that, you know, drug overdoses. People, you know, where I'm at in downtown L.A., it is normal to see homeless people and you know people who are just on drugs you know ODing and and all type of stuff man you know but this is something that ain't really spoke on but it happens you know it's i think is the the third most common death you know overdoses you know and everything you know um yeah especially, yeah, especially third since, most common especially since 2020 yeah there's a lot of people that OD but they didn't you don't know about it's yeah. a lot it's it's a lot of people i mean as soon as that little pandemic started, people were dropping like flies. Not from the pandemic, bro. Yeah. But from like o overdosing and shit. Yeah, it's, it's crazy. It's just wild to me when I see it like up close and personal. Yeah, yeah. When I when I got real friends that's like strung out now. Yeah, yeah. That's sitting in front of Jack in the Boxes like strung out. It's crazy, bro. It's yeah, wild yeah. to me. I just thank the Lord that I ain't ever um, got like that. Yeah, yeah, no, nah, that's a fact. That's a fact, man. You know, uh, this is something I think that all of us who are out here, especially, you know, and I'm not saying they don't happen in other places, but in L.A. have have that come from where we come from, have saw people pa die, pass away. You know, people who we've known, people who we lived in the same neighborhood with, you know, people who we saw walking around our neighborhood. Like, this is something that's very common. Yeah. You know, this ain't nothing that, oh, man, somebody, nah, this is common. You know, uh, this happens a lot, you know, and everything like that, man. So, and, and it, like you said, it's got worse now. You know, now you're seeing 15, 13, 14, 16, 17, 18 year olds that's dying every day from overdosing, too. Like, yeah, like that. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah, like but, it but, but, you know, they don't care. The government really don't care. Nah. Because they want the money from, they, they getting, they eating off that shit. Yeah, yeah. You think they ain't eating off that shit, boy? 
Of course they eat no fucking, so they don't, man. And then fentanyl come from the hospital. I mean, it don't come from there, but they use that shit at the hospital. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. I mean, not like how people using it on the streets, but they, they use that shit in the hospital, too. Yeah, so let me tell you this, bro. Anything that has to do with needing medical attention, they eat, you know? When it comes down to us taking medications, and everything, people need to understand something. Everything that needs to be healed in your body could be healed organically. You could take organic, you know, uh, uh, medications. You could take, you know, eat organic foods, drink organic drinks and everything like that, right? Yeah. But they're going to tell you to take this pill but, because they want you to manage it but continue to come back. But when you see, you know, but you know what really made me really not big on medicine ever since I was a kid for some reason yeah. when I used to see them commercials and they'd be like, take this, take this side. Cialis or whatever type of commercial, yeah. and then it follows right after that with seventy four or or a hundred side effects. Yeah, you yeah. may lose your hair, you may uh get depressed, you may all this shit off that medicine, bro. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's crazy, but yeah, I it's mean, fact. once you start doing your research, you figure out like this shit is the, the what do they call it? Western medicine or something? Yeah, yeah, Western yeah, this, medicine. This ain't it. Yeah, this yeah. Ain't it. I need somebody that's in the middle of um. Africa or Colombia to, to heal me. Yeah. You don't think I'm all I'm saying is bro, they, they can make a jet. They can make a jet that could fly around with all these people in the air. Yeah. But you can't you, you ain't got a cure for cancer. <laughs> I mean of course, man. We know it's a cure. It's a cure for everything. It's look, it's, it's a cure crazy. for AIDS, it's a cure for cancer, it's a cure for all of it. Do we necessarily have those type of uh 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 tools to like you know, know how to cure it because of the medications that they're making available? No. No, because they stop. They, they 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 silence them people. Yeah, yeah, the yeah. The people that teach you that get killed. Yeah. Seriously. I mean, that's a fact. You that's know? a fact. I was watching. I seen some video where this man had, like in the seventies, he had created a way where they can uh, fuel the car by like water or something. Yeah. He did a video and he <laughs> and he got killed mm. like after that. So you know, it's crazy. Um, and then it's probably population control. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's great, but I just be thinking about that shit like, damn, man, that's wild, bro. If you get cancer right now, and if you ain't got no money, you done. Oh, you definitely done. But if you get you some know? money yeah. like Lil Boosie, you'll be okay. Yeah, yeah. It's crazy, bro. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah, that's the world we live in, man. You know, money controls it all, you know? I, that's why I say it's, 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 it's sad that that's what it is. That's why I say, man, you got to be out there doing what you got to do and make sure that you and your family's good, especially as the man. You got to, you know, because if you ain't holding it down, like you say, a lot of these things that we seeing out here, if you don't got the money for it, you're not going to last long out here, man. It's I, just not going to happen. I never knew the importance of getting a job that got benefits. I used to be like, why do you motherfuckers want to work at FedEx and get, yeah, I'm yeah. talking about the people that start off like doing the boxes or whatever, like. They getting twelve, thirteen dollars an hour working weekly. Yeah. So they're not really getting no check. Nah. But nah. they doing it for the benefits. They getting the benefits. You know, yeah. they family get medical care, you know, and everything yeah. like that, you know, which yeah. is very important. You know, but people are basically working <laughs> I think that was good what you brought up, man, because um that's a fact. People are working for their benefits. Yeah. They're not work. They're not working to be able to go out there and you know uh, 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 take trips, go on vacations, go visit family, you know things like that. No, they taking they 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 working these type of jobs for their benefits. Yeah. But but that's why you got to take time in your life to where you got to really like look in the mirror and say, look, I'm gonna take this risk to go out there and do more. Because yeah, you working a nine to five an everyday job, and you getting paid minimum wage. You're basically working for benefits. And, and and to to put food on your table, that's it. That's where it stops. It ain't no vacations. Nothing. It ain't no private school for the kids. It ain't no college fund. It's none of that. It's no name brand food. It's none of that. No Jordans. None of that. Straight up, you know. And if you are getting Jordans, then you you your account is in the negative. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You gonna be or you paycheck the um. You gonna be asking paycheck. moms for money. Hey mom, you know I spent a little bit extra. I had to get little JoJo some uh. So, so some Jordans, you know, she really wanted some Jordans or he really wanted some Jordans, you know. So now you're going to borrow money from moms or or your auntie, you know, or your sister or something like that. You feel me? Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. You know, when it comes down to it, take that risk. Bet on yourself, man. I'll tell anybody in a second. I'd rather, look, this is just me. And it can sound how I want to sound. I'd rather you take a risk and live in your car for a month rather than you be cool with just working a nine to five job for the rest of your life. I'll tell people that too, bro. 
You know, go live in your car for six months. Take that you, risk. You look stupid as hell working at working at KFC for ten years, and then you don't even want to take the manager position because you say it's too much work. But why would you want to work at KFC for ten years? Yeah. You want to work at McDonald's for fifteen years? Yeah, it's crazy. But I mean, some people are just like that. Bro, I did the same. I took a risk. I, I said, okay, I'm I'm working, but I got to try to do this YouTube shit. Mm-hmm. If it whatever happens, just. It gotta happen. I gotta try something, bro. Yeah, people yeah. just they get to that's why I be trying to tell people, stop getting comfortable. Yeah. You get comfortable, you stay at that job for twenty years. You get comfortable, you stay in the same apartment, paying the same amount of rent for twenty years. Yeah, that's a fact. Bro, I got a sister who's been living in the same apartment since two thousand. It's two thousand and twenty four. Yeah. In the same apartment building, in the same unit. I'm just saying some people get, get too comfortable. If you get too comfortable walking around every day and you not Watching, you will get caught slipping, and, and something will happen. Yeah, so it's yeah. just it's all about being comfortable. You never, you always gotta challenge yourself. Yeah, that's why I like they like. Well, you live in this apartment in the rent high. Well, I rather pay high rent than live where somebody the block is controlled by a, a, a gang, bro. Facts. Yeah, so I rather work a little harder than pay six hundred realistically, like six hundred more dollars, because rent in the trenches is high. Yeah, it is not cheap no more, but. Yeah, you just can't. People got to stop being comfortable. Yeah, yeah. You got to start becoming comfortable with being uncomfortable. Yeah. That's what I always say. That's yeah. what you got to you gotta put yourself in that position, especially as a man. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just, I just, it's just hard for me to have respect for dudes out here that's not taking risk and putting themselves through situations that really pull out the best of them. You know? That's why I push business and things like that, you know, and everything, you know, because it's like, hey, go... I don't care if you feel like you have, we all got talents, but I don't care if you feel like, man, I don't know what to do. I got no talent. Then go start getting into business. Educate yourself. Become an entrepreneur. There's a lot of things out here that you could just, you know, you go out there and start flipping cars. Learn how to flip houses. You know what I'm saying? Get Learn YouTube. You know, and everything like that. You know, it's a lot of money on me, you know, in, in tech that you Tell could be getting guys, right now. Learn the security you know? cards. Security, you know? Start your own security thing going. Get about two, three more. Hey, you know, I got a couple of accounts to where we could do some security. I'm going to get us some jobs. Whatever. <laughs> But I'm just saying, you know, start to put yourself in positions to where you're going after more instead of just being comfortable with that job. Because I always say that's what that's what I believe Western education is here for, for, to prepare you for a job, not to prepare you to be an entrepreneur, not to prepare you to run a business, not to prepare you to go out there and make hundreds of thousands of millions. It's to prepare you for a job. When you get out of here, go work at McDonald's, Burger King, Walmart, FedEx, or something like that. That's what it's preparing you for. That's why with most of these jobs, what do you need? You need a GED or a diploma, right? Yeah. That's what they're preparing you for, you ever, to get out of here and work a job, not get out of here and work in corporate or, or anything like that, you know? It's for that and that only. You ever seen the meme of the the... The, it show like the school and then it show the prison. I know you have seen this before where they put it like side to side. No. Nah. Prison school look just like prison, bro. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the same. The cafeteria, the way they feed you, you know the the bus, everything is the same, bro. Yeah. Everything, bro. But yeah. then when you go to certain when you go to other areas, the schools are different. Yeah, that's a fact. But when you look at the schools, bro, like the, the elementary schools got fences everywhere. It's just like prison, bro. It gets you ready for prison. Yeah. Lunch is 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 lunch and jail. It's the same shit, bro. That that's why I really don't. Lunch lunch food at school is jail food. I, I'm saying <laughs> like the, that jail whole food probably better. <laughs> that whole school shit is is crazy because if when yeah. you think about it, they really don't teach you nothing about real history. No nah, hell. Because like a lot of the nah. stuff that I'm learning now or learned in the past four years, just history and all this shit, they didn't teach none of that in school. No, nah, no. Nah. And then you got to think about it. Half these teachers is not getting paid. So you really think they're about to be teaching you? Then I don't trust half of the people. So I really don't push like, oh, you got to go to school. I mean, yeah, you need to go to school. I guess basically you need to learn the basic shit. But yeah. all that other stuff can get taught um, just through regular life. But, yeah, that, that shit ain't nothing, bro. It's really a trap, everything about the whole Western setup. Yeah. go Be good your whole life. Go to school. Uh be in there 10 years to be a, a, a heart surgeon mm-hmm. and then get married and then put a put a little amount of money down on a three four hundred thousand well now a million dollar house yeah yeah and have a loan for the rest of your life oh yeah and you really i mean i got a, a cousin that's a doctor man he's still paying that loan off and he's in his 50s yeah i know somebody personally <laughs> you know what I'm that that. he's in his 50s bro, bro. Started, 57 years old school my 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 um went to usc 
Yeah, my sister, uh, my sister, husband, brother, went started school. I think when he was like eighteen, mm. and didn't get done until he was thirty something. Yeah, yeah. That's just straight school. That's crazy. Yeah, but I'm gonna mean, be paying know, those loans off until he's fifty yeah, or more. Just, that's just like with the with with the nurses. So the people that's supposed to save us, or or be there when everybody's sick, you want them to go to school to become an RN, but they got to take out a two hundred thousand dollar loan. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's crazy, bro. The teacher, the just look at that, bro. The 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 people in the court system make more than the people in the school system. So the yeah. people that's locking the people up is getting paid more than the people that's teaching the kids, bro. Yeah, yeah. Take your kids out of regular school. But you notice this though, <clears throat> people like you that's on YouTube. In fact, most of the YouTube, I'm gonna say about fifty percent of the YouTubers, right, and individuals like me who <clears throat> started business, got into business earlier, you know, and became an entrepreneur and started my own thing and everything like that. None of us got no loans. You feel what I'm saying? You know, I had some school, so I had a, a little bit of loans here and there, oh, but that, like that stuff go. Loan? That's what I'm saying. And you got the ones who went for the education, right? Yeah. And, and, and went to college, four-year degrees, master's, been in school for 10 years, everything like that, right? Yeah. Paying two, three, four hundred thousand dollars loans. And not even working in the job. It's all up for us. It's all up for us that did it entrepreneur style business start your own business or anything or something like that even as an independent contractor doing your own thing in some sort of way it's all up but when you went to school the system that they say hey you go here and this is how you get a better job this is how you you grow in life and everything like that yeah you get that degree but now you have a bill for three four five hundred thousand which is crazy you know everybody that i know that because yeah I, I did some college but I wanted to do on, do my own thing. College was too slow for me. You feel me? So, but everybody who I know that finished four year degrees and master degrees, right? You know, bachelors and masters, all still still paying on loans. You know, from a hundred thousand to five hundred thousand. You know, so that's what I'm saying. You know, like I would teach my kids different, and I hope that people are really teaching their kids different, and not just saying, "Oh, you're gonna go to college just to go." Now, if you're going for a specific reason, okay. But if you're teaching your kids how to be entrepreneurs, how to run businesses, tech, everything like that, you don't necessarily have to send your kid to college because you want them to be better than you. You could teach them how to go out here and be a young entrepreneur and, and, and start something that they could build, have employees, and grow it, you know? <laughs> or, or, or learn media and tech and get on there and start your own thing, you know, and grow a base. You know, it's a, it's a lot of things that you could do nowadays. Back in the days, that's what people was taught, and that's what we thought. Hey, just go get a degree or whatever, right? That ain't the way. We, we see how that come back on, on a lot of individuals. Most people with a degree, they work in regular jobs. The majority of them, they work in regular nine-to-five minimum wage jobs. Yeah. So don't just go just to go. Don't go to school just because I just want a degree. Nah, it ain't worth it. Trust me, because when you get that bill, you're going to be wishing you didn't go. And, and it ain't going to stay off you. Sally Mae is not going to stay off of that ass. You know what I'm saying? That's a fact. Blue you know, so college, look what happened to him. I mean, he blew up. <laughs> For real. Nah, that's a fact. That's a fact. He you said, know, I J. Don't Cole. Wanna, J. I don't Cole. want to do this shit that everybody want me to do. I don't want to play football and go here. Yeah. And he left and did what he did. Multi-millionaire. And he blew up. J. Cole. Yeah. If J. Cole would have stayed and got that degree and had those student loans, <laughs> J. Cole would not be making ten upwards of ten million a year. It just would not be happening. Yeah, it's a trap. Probably. You know, his net worth thirty million plus. You know, so it's definitely a trap, you know, but, um, yeah, so, uh, uh, you know, Milk, you've been a, you've been a talk of, um, street YouTube lately, brother. Yeah. You know, <laughs> you're in a little bit of everything, you know, why do you, why do you think, because this is what I noticed with you, <clears throat> most of the time, I'm, I'm not on YouTube, I, I used to be on YouTube like crazy, just seeing everything that's going on, so nowadays when I'm on there, it's because somebody's saying, hey, go check this out, or I'm just peeking, but, I've been noticing the last month just by even doing that, that Milk Name is in a lot of situations on YouTube when it come down to the streets. You know, you good, bro? You want you some water? You straight? No, I'm good. All right, for sure. <laughs> but uh, just making sure, man, you ain't go, you know, we live. I don't want you to pass out on the table or something, man. No, I'm good. You know, for sure, for sure. No, we good. All right. But um, so uh, when it come down to it, it almost seemed like every in the last month, every time I go on YouTube and I see what's going on, when it comes down to the community, 
when it come down to the streets, just checking and seeing, tapping in just to see what's going on. Somebody's talking about milk. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying milk ain't talking about people either. <laughs> I mean, I do, I I'm not paid. saying that. I get paid. Because I, 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 I know you do your react. I know. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not saying <laughs> people don't feel like they don't got a reason, but. No, they could. You know, I'm saying the last month is you involved in a lot of things. You know, the latest thing that I saw, um, well, it's, it's a couple of things. Like I'm saying, it's, it's, not, it's not just one or two. It's a couple. But um, one of the situations, and I was like, let me talk, ask Milk about this because uh, we've had conversations in the past, and according to what I heard, I believe Milk would have handled this differently because, you know, things that Milk have said and everything like that. So one of the situations was uh, G-Face, you yeah. know, went on No Jumper and, and on his platform and everything like that and basically said he went down to your apartment. Mm-hmm and basically made you take some videos down you know and everything so one thing i would ask first and foremost how did he even know where you was at you tell me that and, 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 and second did this happen no this did not happen. so what's the situation where did i mean because the way He's now a, don't don't get me wrong when it come down to g-face everything g-face be said if he sounded like this dude he, he's believable well you know g-face he, he he got he know how to talk right but 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 explain like where would this come from to where he said with so much confidence that this happened? Well, once I once I start doing my research on him, you find out that he's like a he learned how to be like a good liar because his whole life is a lie. Uh but he got on my radar because I did a reaction to a rapper named uh G Uno. He was on No Jumper. It wasn't the dude uh, Gilligan face on the interview. It was G Uno and 600. They was doing an interview or whatever. He was on there. I did a reaction. They said, hey, man, some paperwork on his name. Woo woo. He used to be from an Armenian gang. Yeah. So I'm like, what? So I go look or whatever. So whatever. I find out he was, it was paperwork on his name or whatever. So I did a video. And uh, I don't know, like, like <clears throat> two months after this video or three months after this video, he come out with this lie. He said he pull up to my house. He pull up with three or four individuals. He get in the apartment. He get up to my door. I open the door. He make me delete videos. So you telling me that the person <clears throat> with the clout, me, him, he searching for the clout. You made me do this and you didn't record me. Nobody recorded nothing. And so if I called you a snitch, what well, it is paperwork on his name. And I called him a hood hop because he did used to be from another gang, an Armenian gang, until he did something and it went bad. But So if I called him all that and you called me at my house and you didn't do nothing to me, you didn't record me and say, oh, I got him right here. He's deleting videos or whatever. So, you know, that was cat, bro. Mm. And the only place he was able to go tell that motherfucking story was on No Jumper. Have you seen him on any other channel? No. Yeah. I, I saw him on another interview. Um, no, I'm talking about you know, not I'm, speaking about that, but yeah, was, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yeah. recently, since since he came out with this goofy ass story, they can't back nothing up, can't prove nothing. How do you know where I live? How do you get in my apartment? You just can't walk up to my door. The whole story is just like just bullshit, cap. And uh, if he would have put up to my house, like you see his videos of people when when I'm walking, they record me, Milk Gilligan or something, and I don't even know they record me, but they record me. So if he catch me and I just called him a snitch, a rat hood hop, and he ain't do nothing, it's no video. So you saying that G Face never approached you? Yeah. Never saw you at no apartment. Never. You never had a conversation at all with G Face N ever. Never. So there, there, there's not ever gonna be no proof of anything just of this situation ever happening. You know, because because this is the way I'm looking. I'm like, if if it if it did, then it did. I mean, it's no it's no shame nah, if somebody you know nah. pulled up to have a conversation. But you saying that nah, everything that's coming out of his mouth is a bold face lie, and it's not ever gonna be a video that ever come out with G Face saying anything to you. If person. a video come out like that, I delete my channel. Wow, I will okay. delete It's Milk TV with 145 thousand subscribers. I delete it. Go get the if so if. You mean to tell me he said he was with three or four individuals and nobody recorded nothing? No video, no audio, not even enough for a short footage feed? Nothing? Nobody was on live? Nothing. Bro, to get up to my apartment, you got to get called. Yeah. So even if you did get... <laughs> bro, 
Bro, you mean to tell me, so if somebody it come to the door, first of all, <clears throat> we can get a call. So if we don't get a call, then you already kind of like, who is this? Is this the police? Who, wh who is this? So now, so somebody random just come to my door, and, and you think it's just going to go like that? I'm going viral. <laughs> You're going to die, bro. Yeah. Man. Man. But, I mean, he never put up to my house. After that, I made a video about the shit. So I called it, still called him a rat, liar, hood hop, clown, Gilligan. I said your name, Gilligan face. Why he ain't put up again? And you know where I'm at. And if you know where I'm at, catch me outside. Wait, you you should be able to catch me. Because everybody see me in public all day. Yeah. So catch me. But this is what I'm saying. He's just talking. He's clout chasing. So if he clout chasing, if he would have got to my apartment and caught me, <laughs> it would have been a phone pulled out. He would have upped the phone, bro. Yeah. There's no way. But, you know, if he's going to lie, it's good. He kept me uh relevant. Yeah. You know, I'm still being talked on talked about on the platform with five million uh subscribers. Yeah. So I'm still yeah. doing good. Yeah. I mean You mean to tell me twenty twenty four. Everybody that catch somebody or something like that, they op enemy rival or something like that, they're recording it. At anywhere. In courtrooms, court parking lots, uh homes, grocery stores, targets, wherever. Yeah. And you didn't pull out a phone? <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah okay but you know that was a good one it was a good one yeah yeah man i mean you know uh i was like you know i was like i need when i first heard about the situation i was like man i want, I want to kind of like see what what I, I know it's always a lie in every situation but there can be truth as well you know that's why i was like well let me see what milk have to say about this i mean i don't i mean when it come down to to G, I don't really, I don't know G Face at all. I, I've seen a couple of his interviews on No Jumper. Um, in fact, his very first interview when he was talking about the truck and stuff, uh, when I was really trying to learn, you know, because I got other businesses and I wanted to, you know, start another one in the trucking direction, right? So um, I didn't really know G Face, but I saw him talking about the truck and stuff. So I did reach out, you know, the way he said, reach out on um, Instagram. Um, never got no response or anything like that you know, our information about, you know, so I don't know if people who have dealt with G-Face really have got help along the lines of that, but it's all good. You know, down the road, I got three trucks now. I'm doing my own thing. So thank God I took my direction. I I figured it out. I got three trucks now, you know, and all of that. Bro. I'm just saying, but when it come down to the information that he gave, it, it, you know, it wasn't necessarily co correct, Bro. but but I don't know the dude. So I'm not saying that G-Face is a fraud or anything like that. That's not, that's not what I'm saying because I don't know him. I'm just saying... Along the lines of something that he stated he on there, I did reach out to, let me learn mm -hmm. more about this. You know what I'm saying? Because at that time, I didn't really know much about the trucking game. So let me see. Never know response. Never know anything. Learned the game myself. All good. I got three trucks now. I'm doing my thing with it. You know so, why? So, so, I, so is he a fraud? I don't know. You know why? I can't say he maybe is or he, he is. Maybe he you said, know? oh, this wouldn't be the perfect person. <laughs> you know? I don't know, or, or maybe because he don't know what? jumper. Wait, look, you know one thing. I, maybe because he don't know jumper. He got, so he, got, he know he know that you know no no jump over he got here. They don't really like what, They don't really like your boy. I mean, he got so four hundred. Maybe that's what it is. I don't know. He, he got four hundred thousand Instagram followers. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Bro, if you go do your research on him, his name used to be Little Ghostface from Armenian Power. Uh, okay. He went to jail and shit and whatever before that. He changed to some other shit, bro. It's paperwork on and, that dude's name. And you said something along the line of snitching. Where you get all this information from? So Man. you said something out that, that, that showed a, he's a snitch? I did a reaction video to a clip on No Jumper. It was 600. It was a rapper that just got out of jail from Compton. I'm like G Uno face or something. I did a reaction to this because they was talking. I forgot what they was talking about, but I had I did a reaction. And in the reaction, comments was like, oh, man, he uh, it's paperwork on his name. He used to be from another gang. He a hood hopper. These is comments. So, you know, me, I go do my um homework, bro. Yeah, yeah. And if you go look on YouTube and you type in the name, bro, uh, yeah, he used to be from a whole another gang. He had a long time in jail to learn how to lie. But uh, if you catch me, so if you didn't record it, go get the footage from the apartment, bro. Go uh, wherever, where, what apartment? Like it, it's just crazy, but yeah. I mean, the one thing that I would say, I mean, you know, I always feel all the 
back and forth is 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 stupid anyways but i get it people want to get their numbers up people want to go viral and all of that i get all There's of that no right back and forth. i i i i i get all of that all of that Wait, part hold on. you know but now what? about the deleted videos if you go back in time me and ad was just kind of going back and forth if you would say he said oh man you just mad because you lost nine, you negative nine million views. Now we're gonna get to that. We don't gotta get into okay, that right now. We're gonna get is, to that. No, yeah, but yeah. I'm saying this what he was saying about the negative nine million views, that was like a month ago before this dude even said something about deleted videos. Yeah. Like a month and a half ago, I deleted three hundred videos. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna get to that. We're gonna get to that. You know, the the, the only thing I was gonna say in regards to this G face thing and then we can move on is that if 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 the, if there are lies going on in regards to it to where he really didn't show up at your house and really Put that out there, standing on that that type of way. That that that's weak. You know, anybody who put out lies like that, like you'll go that far. Yeah, you see lies all the time on YouTube, but you're gonna go as far as to say, I went to this person's house, the house that they live at. You know, apartment, whatever. I went there, I saw them, I went up to their door, told them to delete every video you got up of me. I mean, that that's that's one of the most coldest lies that you could you could hear right there, man, what, when it what, come down to it. You know, you gotta you gotta prove something like that though. What, if you're gonna bro, come out with that. Now did it happen? You saying it didn't happen. It didn't happen. Okay, so so I, I wasn't there, I don't know. One but I'm just thing. saying if he's lying, man, that's that that's a lie that needs to throw your ass off YouTube straight up. One I mean, I'm just saying if it's a lie. This is the same dude that put a video out on this rapper. From P, I think he's from Pico Rivera. That's L.A., I think. But Pico Rivera, Bozo the Clown. That's his Bozo. Yeah, I think his name Bozo the Clown. Bozo. He put a video out on Bozo that wasn't even real. Like a, a AI type video with Bozo on the phone. And it's like a girl on there saying she underage. Mm. And this video is fake. Could be proven to be uh like edited and fake. Yeah. This dude is a clown, bro. He does it. He been doing this. He used to be from another hood, bro. People get it confused. I'm not saying you, because you're from L.A., but all these other people on, on the internet, they think because he's Armenian and he got these tattoos and shit, that shit don't mean nothing to me. Because I know people that got tattoos that ain't even, that got like, they look like they got like gang tats, and they ain't even, it's not even like that. Or them people with tattoos, that shit don't really mean nothing when they try to use it to be like, this is my image and and, and I'm hard, and you're going to listen to me. Prove it. If you came to my house, you would have recorded it. Go get the apartment footage. The same people, whoever, however you got in here, however you mysteriously got in the elevator that need a five. You talking about a pin code. Ain't no pin code. I don't live in no apartment in North Hollywood or wherever Lil Arminia at. You yeah, feel yeah. me? It's key five. So how you get up here? How you find my dough? And how did you catch me at my dough? I opened my dough. And you still have walked up out of there and wasn't under no sheet, bro. It's not yeah, making no sense. I mean, sense. That, that would that would be a crazy lie, man. Look, look. No matter what, I put it. I put it like this. We all lie sometimes, man. It it, it happens. Not like but, that. But but no, no no. But that's what I was gonna say. But if you lie, if your lie go as far enough to say, I went to a person's house, I saw them, and I had them delete videos, and it's a lie. You got a mental condition. It's something mentally going on with you that ain't right. So that's why I'm saying, like, I don't, I wasn't there. I don't know what happened. But I'm just saying if that is a lie, that's something that you need some 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 help. You need some therapy, you know, some type of therapy. You know, you need to sit right. down with somebody and get some help if that's a lie. You Bro, know what him, I'm saying? Him saying? You know, and, and I'm not saying that to call you a liar, Milk. I'm not saying so. I don't want you to take it as that. I'm, I'm not. If, if, you, if, if you're not there, I can't say whether it's a lie or not until somebody come out with something showing what it really was. I'm just saying... If somebody would go that far, and that's a lie, you have a mental disorder. And that's what people got to understand. It's a lot of people on YouTube that y'all look up to right now that have mental conditions. I get it. They funny or they make you laugh or they make you. No, these people have mental conditions and they are entertaining you guys. And you guys are looking up to them and everything like that. No, y'all got to understand that. You know, just because you know how to make a little bit of bread, and this ain't speaking about no one specific, but I'm just saying, just because you know how to make bread or you know how to go on YouTube and make a video go viral, that doesn't mean that you should be following that fool. That don't mean that. People really have issues mentally. Nowadays, because of the ways you can make money and the easy ways you can make money, if people just think that, hey, I I'm just going to follow this person and this person is getting views or whatever, you can make money nowadays. But I want y'all to understand, y'all may be following someone who is leading y'all into a direction police. that's going to make y'all now have mental disorders and mental conditions. 
So watch who y'all following. I just wanted to point that out, man, because we see in a lot of situations like this, there's a lot of YouTubers out here that are really messed up in the head that is leading people to hell. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know, but but going back to that situation, man, I just want to like make that clear because I was like, okay, if this happened, how did this situation even happen? Because I already know your situation where you talked about, you know, where you live and how you got to get into your building and all of this. I don't live in no house. You get you what just I'm saying? Can't, yeah. Okay, so you just can't pull up to my house. Now you mean to tell me you pull up, you don't record, you in front of the apartment saying, I'm going in here. Every other video I seen where somebody said they was at somebody's house, they recording it. It's no way you're not just coming. <laughs> so, But then on top of this, bro, people die for calling people snitches. People die for that shit. Of course. Okay, so I called him that. So you mean to tell me you caught me at my house and you just talked? You didn't hit me. You didn't do nothing? Yeah. Yeah, that, that shit is capping. He need to prove it because it's like you, yeah, you, you, gotta you prove said that. this. Yeah. Yeah. Prove it. Record. Yeah. We'll go get the footage. In today's day, you're going to have had that video these, recorded. That's if, what I'm saying. I'm, that's what, I don't I don't know if, if he if said he got footage. It's 100 people that live where I live at. This is what people don't understand. It's a million people live there. It's the people that work at the front desk. It's all these different people. It's the people that live there. Yeah. It's people that live. I don't live on the floor by myself. Yeah. So where is these people at? Go get the people. Let's ask the chat. Hey, 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 chat. And, and we'll read it later. Hey, chat. If y'all believe that G Face really went to Milk House, he got footage and, and he could prove it. Let us know what y'all thoughts are on that. that. You know what I'm saying? Let us know if y'all believe what G-Face is saying, chat. But like you said, if he did, he got to prove it. But I want to know what the chat. Do y'all believe that chat? Man, I you know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm not. You, I you got sound, lawyer you sound, money. You sound, I got lawyer you sound, money. I'm not saying you sound uh, believable. Bro, like I don't got to lie. Like if somebody catch me somewhere and try to do something, I will tell people. Yeah. Like, like. People that recorded me or whatever, I did reactions on that shit. Yeah. I'm not hiding nothing. And they didn't even catch me. They was in the in the street three lanes over and recorded me and I didn't even know. I got headphones in my ear. But what I'm saying is, bro, if they catch milk, there's no way I'm not getting recorded, bro. Yeah, that's a fact. That defeats hey. the purpose. You act like you just coming to kill me. This the same dude that did a video and said, I I got this amount if you get me if you line him up for me I don't even be want to record react to that shit because that's like weird federal shit but this is the same weirdo like he's a clown bro he's just trying to clout chase I never was going back and forth with him I never specifically said oh I'm deleting this video I deleted about 300 videos bro because a lot of them wasn't making money and if it don't make money, it don't make sense. Yeah, and then up, a yeah. lot of them was repetitive videos. Like if it was 10 videos on this person, 10 reactions on this, like, and it just, that shit was old and it, it just wasn't it. When I got to a hundred thousand subscribers, I learned how to do reactions better. Yeah. Where I don't show the whole video in the video and I kind of, it'd be here and then I'm just whatever. But yeah. so when I get to different levels, I do different shit. I deleted a hundred videos, two hundred videos. You can't yeah. give a fuck about nine million views. And talking about that, also since the last time you was here, we just we we a part of the hundred K team. Yeah, so, you know yeah, what I'm saying? hell so, yeah! Congratulations you know what I'm on saying? that hundred thousand, bro. Appreciate that, bro. That's appreciate a that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm gonna tell you, a lot you, of work to get it, there, but we a, got there. It's a lot of people that been it, boy. It's people that been out here for years. Yeah, yeah. Now, I ain't gonna name them because I don't want them to be going crazy and and, and probably <laughs> going into a deep depression. But I'm telling you, I seen a channel, bro. That was doing interviews and shit. I'm, I'm not going to say no name, but they was doing interviews a few channels. And they still, and then they was more, and they was re, inter, internet relevant. Mm. They was celebrities low key. Oh, wow. They didn't been around the multi-platinum artists. Yeah. And you got other people that quit. And I wasn't even in their lane. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't even, yeah. and they quit. Wow. So, you, I mean, bro, a uh, 100,000, I didn't see people out here when I started. They was already doing it. Yeah, yeah. And they still ain't got to that. Yeah, I ain't crazy. even too. Crazy, man. You know? I'm being real. Well, thank God, man, we crossed it, man. You know, a year, about a year and about seven months, you know, seven, eight months. We, you know, we crossed it, so thank God for that. Bro, I'm and and you. we appreciate everybody who support. Appreciate, you know, people like you, Milk, coming through and, and showing love and everything. So, so yeah, you know, uh, before we do uh, uh, move uh, move on, uh, I want to ask you, Big Don, uh, what you you think, you, what you think, Big Don? You think G-Face is um, being real? You think he uh, he really pulled up? You think he got a video on the cut? What you think, Big Don? Man, I think we would have been done seeing the video by now. Sure. Yeah, yeah, that's a fact. 
That's Everybody in the chat says he's capping. Okay. Everybody okay. that caught Charleston okay. White, a video was there. Yeah. Every time. Yeah. I'm the, but but you gotta understand, I'm the clout token. You gon' that's gonna be the same for you. You gonna have channels that's gonna be. Yeah. Next thing you know, all the, you gonna be seeing them. They gonna be reacting to all your shit. Oh, already talking about you. Look, saying shit like, but that's cool. You know why? You know why you don't give a fuck? I mean, you don't sweat that. You don't care about that. Yeah. Because that's keeping you relevant. Yeah. That's kind of like free promo. Yeah. Long as it ain't, you know, whatever. But, but, but other than that, that's that's what kept me like them days. I don't do videos. I don't got to because so many people didn't was doing videos. You keeping my name going, so I love that. It's yeah. promo cost. Yeah. I have never got paid for promo. I'm going to start probably, but I never have. But all of that shit was free promo. That's what I had to learn. People like, you don't go crazy. No, because I don't pay attention to that shit. I don't really even look at it. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> they yeah, got to have a I certain feel. amount of subscribers for me to even pay attention to, to. That's what I'm saying about that clown Gilligan face. It was never a, a back and forth with him. It was, I said what I said. That's it. You are nobody, a failed rapper. You still trying to rap or whatever. You got, in my eyes, a fake Instagram following. How do you got 400,000 subscribers? And I've never heard of you until that no jumper clip, bro. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, and, and I just want to uh, 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 take a step back a little bit with something that you said because you're right. Never, I never mentioned it because, you know, for what? These niggas are lames. But I've definitely saw many channels that, who've reacted to videos and, you know, when uh, talking a little shit, you know, have something to say about me, you know, have something to say about the way I, uh, uh, the hair, the all type of stuff, you know, yeah. like, like people who do this once a week. I've seen channels and everything like that. And one thing that I want to say, I'm never gonna mention y'all, y'all, y'all niggas' names. Never, never, ever. I would never do that. I don't, under, I don't understand individuals who do say people names who, who, who they do see saying something about them. I'm not finna make give nobody no relevance. Well, it depends. You know, it took a lot of work to build something like this. I'm not finna it, shout out nobody. I just want to say wait, one more thing. The only reason I've ever called out anybody like a no jumper or, or whoever is because they disrespected the platform. I get it if I'm disrespecting your platform, but if you just want to, you know, uh, 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 talk talk mess and, and and react to videos and everything like that, talking crazy about me or this platform, do it. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. I, I want to give you this. Thank you. Thank you. Because you're the individuals that make us hot. You're the individuals that make us grow. You're the individuals that build us. You're the individuals that watch the channel more than the people who support. For real support, the ones who are real fans, the one who are the ones who are real family to what's going on here. You watch more than them. You studying RV move. So I just want y'all to know, to know. I see all of y'all who doing videos, talking head, talking mess. Can't can't in the can't in the chat or hit hit your boy up on Instagram and say, hey, this is the way I feel. Let's have a conversation. Can't do that behind your little screen doing your little videos talking crazy. I appreciate all of y'all. Just know that. Keep watching. Keep supporting. You know what I'm saying? So I just wanted to put that out because I, I see a lot of that. I never speak on it. But, yeah, I see that all the time. So you're right about that, you know? So it's free promo. As long as they ain't free promo, like bro. Got, free promo. As long as they ain't saying you got, like, no uh, diseases or no nah, shit like nah. that. It's, it's, and it's, that's when it get different. Yeah, yeah. Talking yeah. head, trying to be funny, no, you know, different. and everything. Yeah, do, the, do your thing, though, that's you know? free promo. Yeah, free yeah. Promo be costing. Yeah. So you ain't lying. So and then you giving me you 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 showing me to a whole nother audience. Yeah, too. your five thousand you know subscribers. Yeah. You know, hey, that's another five right there. You know what I'm saying? Hey, yeah. add them to the collection. You feel me? So it is what it is, man. So uh, let's move along. So uh, I also saw a video. So I thought you and Smack and every you know I thought y'all was cool now. You know I saw a video recently where you know he was kind of like calling you out in regards to calling you broke. You know, basically saying, you know, uh, 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 show show your back end, show what's going on. Because I know you did, and I think it came from this, and you correct me if I'm wrong. I believe it came from, because I know in the past you mentioned his name wasn't on nothing. And, 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 and you know, um, where where is where is his money really coming from? Because his name isn't on nothing. You know, that's that that's T. Rail's name and, 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 you know, and everybody that's around him. But his name isn't on nothing. So he got to talking about, hey, you know, where your bread at? You know, and everything. So where did this conversation come from? I thought y'all was cool. You know, you went on, you went over there on, on Fig Munity and everything. Yep. And then I saw this video. So where did this all come from? Correction. I never went to uh, Fig Munity. They don't really interview people from Fig and 
Compton, no, you went LA. to Back on Fit. Yeah. That's where you were. Okay, Fig my bad. Back on really Fit. Now. Yeah, you went to Back on Fit. Got they you. did like a open, they copying your shit and did like an open mic or whatever. Oh, yeah, they and all they copying. Got, and they got somebody from Baldwin. They all copying, bro. We can call it out now because you see it. Hey, uh, we call, hey, when we call this out, people say, oh, why are you talking about it? I, Hey, I call it out because I stand on it. Everybody copying what's going on over here. We started this. We started the booth. Now you got no jumper over there. They get doing a little you know, brick baby doing his little 16 or whatever. <laughs> Never saw that before. You got all type of individuals copying over everything. You got the, the Adam and Wax show. Just to be real, me and Cowboy was doing that since day one. <laughs> everything that we do, we see everybody emulating. But like I said, it's all good. I just want to call it out. I appreciate all of you. All of you look up to, to what's going on here. Even though y'all was here before me, y'all got way more views. Y'all been doing y'all thing, but I do appreciate it. It's just funny that you said it because I see this all the time. Every once in a while we talk about it, you know, but hey, it's putting this in a proof. Y'all see it, but go back to what you were saying. My bad, bro. Um, Yeah, no, I think because I had DM'd him okay. recently and I was like, whatever, like, just around the lines of like, I ain't trying to be in your pockets, but I hope you were getting X amount of dollars a month from uh, your job. <laughs> I just, I had DMV, bro. We ain't really, I ain't got no funk with uh, Smack, bro. Yeah, yeah. 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 So it was but just I, off of that DM. That that came just from the DM. Yeah, that other shit. Oh, I mean, okay. that shit months with that LLC, shit, LLC situation. Yeah. That's oh, I mean, I'm pretty sure whatever he said, he already got that over with. I DM'd him recently. Yeah, yeah. I'll be still talking to Smack, bro. But, yeah, that ain't nothing, bro. I, Because I, I was curious, you know? Like, I just wanted to know. Yeah. Because, cause, and the only reason I asked him, this is why I asked him. Because the, the stream T-Rail had recently did, he had said, ask Smack. He getting paid. I don't know what he be doing with his money, but he getting paid over here. So I'm like, okay, I want to ask him since he said that. And yeah. then I DM'd him. Yeah. But that's probably why he said that. <laughs> yeah, he, I mean, he got off on you a little. Not nothing too crazy, no, he really but he, got did, he got off on you. He got yeah, off cool. on you. I ain't yeah, tripping yeah. off that shit, but he really got off on Brick Boy. Oh, uh, over there at No Jumper? Yeah. Oh, okay. But, uh, yeah, no, nah, it ain't really no, um, no, uh. But at the end of the day, too, because you you know the game and everything, milk. I I know you know deep down, like he he, he making money though. I you would know, because because they they they. I, I don't think. Hope. Cause, okay, I, I put it hope. like this. I put it like and this. I'm let's let's say this. this. Let's say this really quick. You know, back on figures making money. We we yes. see it. We see, not, okay okay cool. That. Do you think that Smack is sitting next to T Rail and not getting a bag? You feel what I'm saying? Like like, do you really think that he's sitting next to him? <laughs> And, and, and T-Rail is saying, oh, Smack gets a bag here. And Smack is sitting next to him hearing that and not saying nothing. No, in fact, he's saying, yeah, nah, I get a bag here. And a nice bag. You think that he's not getting a bag over there? For real? And you know they making bread. Yes, but. They got they even got sponsorships and stuff going on up that's over there. Every, that's, all, that's, all, yeah. that's all cool. I get that. Okay. I do. But the ones that be closest to you, they be screwing you. I don't give. I don't care what you say. I don't yeah, care what nobody fact. say. It them people that think they can get over and they think smack a little. What, how do I say that? What like put, uh, right? He a little. Can I say slow? I mean, say what you want to say. Is that correct? No, nah, I mean, if I that's what be you like feel. Politically, no, nah, but I'm trying to say the right like terminology, the politically correct way, I guess. But if they think he's I, I, a little okay, slow, okay, let's just say. But I'm just mentally saying, challenged. Yeah, mentally challenged. Okay, and why? You know they. When I, I've never, and I'm not saying I never noticed that with with, with smack or anything. No, I'm just saying, I'm saying if that's they that's think another that, word for, yeah. for 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 slow mentally challenged or whatever. Basically. They think they can get over him on him because they don't really he don't really know nothing. How do we know that he even knew they got an LLC? How we know that the, he didn't find that out when when milk put the pressure out? I don't know that. I can't I can't prove that. But what I can prove is his name wasn't on that, bro. And then they tried to double back. And say, oh, well, it might be because he owes taxes or something. Yeah, okay. Uh, but I think the other dude owes taxes too or something. Or, or in some more hot water than uh, him. But that's just my opinion. Yeah. But, you know, I'm just saying I, I'm doing this out of love for Smack. I just want him to be okay. You said, do I think he over there? I, if he was, I couldn't tell. 
Yeah. But we do know milk just because you're not on the LLC or a part of the business doesn't mean that you're not making bread. Like but that that's don't what mean, that's what employees But that don't mean when they sell that shit. When they sell that shit. Look, 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 that let me don't just mean, say this though. In fact, as as a business owner, a person who's been running business for fifteen years, my employees and the people who work for me get paid before me. You get what I'm saying? So so that doesn't mean that he ain't making a bag but he don't supposed when it comes down a, to it. He don't supposed to be an employee. He's supposed to be he's he's supposed to be like a a a, a boss on there, like a fifty fifty type of split. Yeah. yeah, I mean, if that's the case, that's the case. But that's another story. We was talking about making money. No, that's what I'm talking. Yeah, I'm about. just saying I don't think that he's sitting next to T. Rell and not making money. Yeah, but he's what on is LLC making or not? But what is making money? I'm not in his pockets, but I'm saying what is making money then? Well, well you did say you know you started talking. Uh, that leads to making money. The, some of the things that you said. So so it is about money. You no, know? no, no, no. I'm saying what if he's making money? I'm saying like what is money? What what is he getting like? But I'm saying I don't want to be. That's the target, another story. What is he getting? Two thousand a month. I mean, who knows? That's a whole nother story right there, <laughs> That's what bro. I'm saying. I'm just, a whole nother story. You know, I'm, I'm just saying I believe that he's getting the bag there. I believe that he's made. Yes, he's not going but, to sit there every day and not getting a paycheck. You okay, know let's what I'm just saying? say what. What if they getting? Let's just say ten thousand a month. We just gonna say that ten mm -hmm. k a month, and he getting two. <laughs> Bro, I mean, you got you got a lot of things you got to take. Nah, if you run a business, nah, but all you, you got no, but you that split got to be that split got to be with everybody then. But you got expenses and everything. Yeah, okay, so but so if you get in two, if you get in two out of ten, that ain't that ain't bad. If you got expenses that you got to take care of as a business, nah, you get what I'm saying? Nah, like a, a lot of time, a lot of times, bro, you know, you start to make money. You don't start to make money until you start to get into a hundred thousand. No, they make like it. that as a business owner. So I'm saying if Smack is getting two out of ten. T. Rowe may not even be getting, I'm not saying, and I'm not saying that's the number, but I'm saying if you only have 10 coming in and this person is getting two, you may be even get, be getting more than the one who owns the business. You know, if you got a lot of expenses when it comes down to making the show run every month. So that's a whole nother story. See, see, this is the thing, Milk. See, you have a reaction channel, so everything go to you. You don't have, you know, co-hosts. You don't have guests. Been doing no, 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 no. They look, was look, doing it at their house. You, you not, you not, they you was not, doing it at their house, but, but, bro. But, but still, it's still setting up. It's still making sure that you have the, the the right people around to make it run. You know, you have guests. You have other people sitting at the at the seat next to you and everything. All these individuals got to get paid to make it run. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. It's a little it's bit three different. People, it's three people on there. All I'm saying is I just don't And believe, all those people got to get paid. All, I, all I'm saying in my head. This is my this is my opinion. Mm -hmm. He ain't getting treated equally. He's not being treated fair. But you don't know though. I, I just just that's my thought. I ain't been wrong yet about about <laughs> is that that's shit. your thought. Yeah, I ain't been I ain't been wrong. But yet. but you don't but but let's but let's I don't say, know. But you it's don't have proof. Okay, that's all I was saying. You don't have proof. This is seventy four twenty six percent. Yeah, and I don't have proof. But I did have I did have proof he wasn't on the LLC. Yeah, I mean, why is you yeah. not on the LLC? Your boss. I mean, if you want to speak on it, that's a whole nother thing. You know, uh, I, I'm not, I don't mean to even go into my business, but in, unless you you really had a huge investment, invested money and everything like that in the beginning. Bro, he was. No, no I, I'm, I'm, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. And then have a sit down on why you may or may not go on it. Like like you said, they said something dealing with taxes or whatever, right? Mm -hmm. if, if there's a legitimate reason, then. I'm going to just put my name on the LLC, even if I do got partners or people who's going to be working for it or whatever. And so, that is, so that isn't too much of a big deal when it comes down to the way things are going to be flowing what, later. What did, That's all I'm yeah, saying. Yeah, okay, but he still ain't on it. They could sell it tomorrow and he ain't got to give him shit. But what I'm saying is, what if he didn't... That ain't true. What that did, ain't true. What if he didn't know that, it, that they got an LLC? What if he didn't even know what an LLC was, bro? But let me tell you why that ain't true. Because at the end of the day, what really matter are contracts. They can have contracts in place that probably say, hey, even, if this business gets sold, I'm just, but you don't know. I'm just saying, you LLC. don't have to be on the LLC. But if we did a contract that say, hey, if this business gets sold or something happened with it, this is my percentage that come to me. And it's notarized and you got lawyers involved. Oh, he's going to get his bread rather he was on the LLC or not. Bro, That's a fact. Bro. You, I'm just speaking facts, man. That's bro, it, bro. Because I know business. You yes, know I know business. You, so that's all I'm saying. That's you, a fact. You do, but I don't think he do. That's what I'm trying to tell you. So if he, I don't this know. all I'm saying, and then I'm done with a little situation. Bro. Yeah, yeah. No, I feel you. But, bro, if 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 he wasn't on the LLC, homie, and he didn't probably even know what that was, or know they got it, because I don't know that. But so if he wasn't on that, I doubt he even got a contract. 
<laughs> no, I mean, I, I, I look, oh, man. I mean, of man. course you don't know their business, but I, I would say I believe that they all probably got contracts with each other. I, I always say I don't leave that friend stuff and and brother stuff and all that out the picture when it come down to business. You know, once you get into, hey, we're going to be making a bag or we got something going on, we getting a deal going or whatever, you better make sure it's contracts involved. So, so when it comes down to that, I, I would say that I think they probably do have contracts at least. I, 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 he don't got to be on the LLC, but I I believe he probably got a contract. I, I doubt that. Um, I, I really, I, right. I, he didn't even know, the, he didn't even, wasn't even on the LLC, bro. I'm pretty sure he asked him, and maybe now because of the LLC shit, but so if it's three people and we getting 11000 a month, what's the split? What do you I mean, they I'm have they with? split. I don't no, know. I'm I don't know what they got. No, I'm talking about if it's yeah. me and you, uh -huh. and it's three. If it's me, you, and him. Yeah. And we getting eleven thousand a month. What is our split? Thirty three and a third. Okay, so straight up. Okay. Yeah. Then we are worried about the. But but it depends in the beginning. He was there. What was invested in it? Nothing. When it comes down to all the partners, like I've started business with individuals that I may have invested. 70% of the of the of the uh, of the funds, right? Yeah. So my percentage was a little bigger because I was going to be doing this day to day, they wasn't going to be doing it day to day, plus I put in more money so my percentage was going to be bigger. Yeah, but his so face, it depends on what they yeah, but situation Smack, but Smack is. Yeah, got a face value on that shit. Yeah, yeah, you do. He was 100% a factor in it even it, I'm not saying it could have went nowhere if he wasn't on it, but Smack been on it since the beginning. That was the whole him and T Rell and Smack. So mm -hmm. that's all I'm saying. I just be hoping, you know, that they ain't over there working, my boy. That's all nah, I'm saying. I, 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 don't, I just don't people, see that, man. I think people, they got it. I mean, especially what they went through at No Jumper. Every, you got to remember, too, where they came from. They came from a situation where. And they don't want to pay nobody now. They don't even want to pay nobody now. You hear that? Did, did, did you get paid when you went, went on the Hell show? Hell no. Nah. You didn't get paid a dollar? No. Uh. Well, maybe they feel this is family, man. It's back on Fig, man. We from we from figure out. You know what I'm saying? Maybe his, I don't know. He going through a situation right now with his brother because the brother felt like he wasn't getting put on the payroll or or you know or something like that. But all I'm saying is, Who? bro, Who you talking T Rail about? brother. All I'm saying is, you saying they went through they shit at no jumper. But How do they, you know that? How do you know that T Rail went through something with his brother? Because they, it he was on the pay. internet. They okay. You didn't see, see that's this? what I'm saying. I ain't seen no. What, so so on the internet, it showed his brother. They come like like they they they, they doing a show the or something. On fig, bro. Okay. The brother came and and him and Tyrell had a heated back and forth. This is facts. Live on the show. Live. Mm. Okay, and it was about bread. It was just about a lot of shit, but yes, that was one of the biggest things. Like you know, I'm coming on here for for free, and then mm. you know, it's like if I if I want to do my own shit, it's like it, yeah, it's about like. He and then he's saying like, why I can't get a spot on here? Yeah, I mean maybe it's it's not a good fit. I don't know, but they brothers though. Brothers gonna you know what I'm saying? Or, he, if somebody, oh, the brother, look, look, the brother, if somebody saw me and my you know people know my my little bro sit you know he at this table with me sometimes when it come down to some of the shows that we do. If somebody saw a back and forth with me and my brother, that's my brother. Yeah, but this you know what I'm a, saying? This, live or not, we live all I the time, so that. it may happen. But this not a regular back and forth. This is not old. Me and you, you feel like Dolph didn't get caught slipping because he did, he should have been at that spot. And I'm telling you, nah, he too big to be there. This ain't that type of argument. This is like, hey, motherfucker, you ain't from the street. Stop lying to people. You from Rialto. This, man, get rid of them orange fucking couches and shit. Stop doing that, living off my name. He said T-Rail from Rialto? No, he didn't say that. I was just using that as, oh, a, okay. as a reference. If I, if oh, I'm trying to figure out what's because, I don't, like no, I said, I don't he, know what's he going He just on. went on there and was saying like, you know, you you ain't never you never was official. You never got put on, and you using my name and and, and, and my shit to get on and, and lying to these people and all this. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you could go find it somewhere. But at the lying. end of the day, though, the, the only thing that I would say f on that is that you know because I I came from a big family and you know I've I have siblings. You know that you know we're close and everything. Whether it's live or not, especially if you do live all the time. That's your brother. It, it happens, man. Yeah, but not you know like what that. I'm saying? It happens. You ain't, you ain't Bro, you know where we come from. Sometimes yeah. we turn up. Like, okay. it happens. Well, he just went it, in, he I don't just, think that it... I he don't think... just went and sat down with Adam-22. Who? The shit he was saying on live, bro, some of that shit is T like... T-Rail's brother? Yes. When he sat down with Adam-22? Yes. Now, that's a different story. Now, I mean, even I, the shit I gotta he take was saying, Even the shit one. he was saying on live, bro, it's not like me and you getting on there saying, hey, you got beat up. You, I remember when yeah, you got know beat that up part. and you didn't even fight hard back. He's standing on there like, you ain't no motherfucking game banger. Stop doing this. Oh, and it was over because 
the brother, this what it was. The brother spoke on a situation about AD. Uh-huh. He gave, he voiced his opinion. But he didn't do it on a platform. Catch it. He did it on his Instagram, I think, or he was on Instagram Live, if I ain't mistaken. And uh, Terrell White, Terrell White or his girl Heather DM'd him. I don't know their relationship, but I don't think they that close. And uh, she DM'd him and said, you know, whatever, I don't think, I guess you shouldn't be speaking on that like that. And basically, like, I guess they mad because he ain't coming on their shit talking about it because they want to control what he say. Uh. They don't want him to really say what he said. Yeah. So, you know, it was it was a lot of shit in that pot boiling. But, yes, this was on live. It, it, it I think Trail deleted it now because of some other shit because of the shit with the stunner girl uh, boyfriend, too, pulling up to his house. I mean, when you when you said that he went on no jumper to me, I, I zip, it's nothing. I more posted to say. it on that, my that, Instagram. That right there's a that's a total that that that's crossing a line, you know. Now, now, you know, me and my bro, we get live, whatever. That that's us. But I'm telling you this right now, and the bro know that I say it right here. You know, he watching whatever. My bro take his butt over there to no jumper and say anything about me. That's cut off for life. You get what I'm saying? Like that's a whole nother story. I didn't know that he went on. This is so you saying this is after their argument. He went on no jumper a few days and talked mess about. It T-Rail. ain't came out yet, but you. But I, I'm pretty sure he said something. Yeah, I hope that ain't what it is, man. You know what I'm saying? Because you know that's that. Yeah, I hope that ain't what it is. That's all. That you can't never take that back, bro. The because shit I'm telling you this, bro. The I, shit I, Adam on 22 the, ain't never taking that, bro. Back. The shit you can't the, take that back. The shit on the live. You know, yes, I know brothers get into it. I got a brother. We we like a year apart. We got into it. Fought. I didn't stab. I didn't put iron in his arm. Yeah. Because he bigger than me. And he would try to, uh, you know, grab me and hold me and, you know, do that. So I didn't put metal in his arm. So I understand that. But to go on my inst- go on my channel and say, you ain't from Hoover, you ain't this, or you you ain't nothing, or, you know, real, like, smutting type shit. Some will say, like, in some way, career canceling, almost kind of type of shit. I'm not saying it might do nothing to him, but that might hurt somebody. Your brother ego or any image or anything, bro. Yeah, yeah. You feel me? That's I'm, all I'm I mean, saying. I mean, even that right there, I gave I w- I would even give him a pass for that because, like I say, brothers go. F- Look, that's the you knew him your whole life. And, y'all, and he, just because y'all live doesn't mean if y'all argue, you're gonna remember y'all on live and nah, not say nah. things to to that's gonna be cut. Nah, off. you Th- know we on live. I, I'm saying no, but the thing that that I'm talking about that really got to me when I'm saying like, nah, that's that's pushing the line right there. Is if he went on no jumper, he did and did an interview knowing. How his bro feel about bro, he, Adam? Knowing they was talking about each other's kids, wives, everything. Knowing all of that, you shouldn't go you on there. Period. On there, then, right? That, that's that's cut off for life. You shouldn't that's go on cut there. Off period. Life, then you know, I, you know, I'm a lo- I'm a love you from a distance. I'm a pray for you, but for life in this life, that's cut off bro, for life. I'm telling you, you go right that now, far. If that was me in that situation, you didn't even have to go to no jumper. The shit you did on the live stream, it would have me. It would have me thinking different. The only time I'm for be life seeing though, you, that's for your life. Bro. You know, no for jumper, life. I get it. No, for life. Because now I'm thinking, now I'm worried if you're going to try to backdoor me. Yeah, you my brother. Brothers kill people, knock people down. Can't kill, can't kill Abel. You know, we know, we know what happened. You yeah. know what I'm saying? You never you know. know. Uh, Greed. Uh, people be maybe jealous. He thinking like, man, I'm the, I'm the real gang banker. You know, I'm really from Hoover, bro. Maybe he's saying like, man, he ain't really from Hoover. He only been able to claim it because of me. This is what he's saying on there, bro. Yeah, yeah. Why you got all this orange on here and all these orange couches and shit telling people to put oranges in the chat and all of this? What's, what's T-Rose's brother name? Uh, Big Deal. I'm going to just say this. Big Deal. I hope you didn't go to no jumper, bro. I mean, I hope I hope Milk just. I hope this is something. Maybe he had him trying to start. So I don't know. Maybe it's a picture he threw out you there. You can go that, look on my Instagram. I, big deal. I hope you did not go on no jumper, though, bro. Please tell me that's a lie because that's another level, man. That's your brother. You know that that's that's just too much. Hey, hey Big Don, what, what what your brother? Yo, your, your brother. Tell me this, Big Don. Your brother. You know, y'all go back and forth alive on live. Would you cut him off of that or? Before the no jumper thing, or do, would it have would it take the no jumper thing for you to cut your brother off? What are your thoughts on that, Big Don? Because you got brothers too. Yeah, I got a couple brothers, man, and you know, blood is thicker than mud. You know what I'm saying? And even though Kane did kill Abel, there are some things that you're gonna have to 
love your brother from a distance for. <laughs> And I think that's one of them. But the but the no jumper thing, would you cut him off if if that happened? If he go that far and going on on, on a platform that you know is real issues with? I might have done it before that is what I'm saying. Okay, okay. I see where y'all at with it. I'm just saying, you know, I know when it come down to my little bro, if we was here, because I know some things could get heated. Yeah, but I don't, my, no, no, I'm going to tell you this. My bro would never disrespect me but like that. But y'all argument I'm just is saying. not with the, no, I this know, is what I I'm know. saying. Y'all might be getting into it like, whatever, I'm the big brother, or... I did this first, or I'm the one, or something like that. I'm That's saying, what even you mean, if, he did. He's yeah. not going to get on here and say, you a broke motherfucker. You living in somebody's car and, and coming on YouTube or something. We'll have a timeout, but I'm not going to cut him off for life. Shit. That's what I'm saying. If, if that happened, Shit. I'm not going to cut him off for life. Now, we ain't going to talk for a minute, but for life, no. The no jumper thing, that's for life. You went on some. You went on a serious enemies platform, you know? That's for life, man. You know, but but I'm I, I, I always look. I'm all about us 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 coming together, man, and us not, you know, uh, 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 drawing lines down the sand when it come down, especially blood and family and everything. So I'm gonna keep saying I hope that no no interview come out with them and everything, and and hopefully this is just you know something Adam just trying to you know promote or or, or lie about. Hopefully it's something like that, you know. Uh-huh. But but I I just hope that they able to work it why out. Why would he? Why would he? Why would he lie? Of them, because you know it. it that's some serious, man. That's right. That's serious. Alley. That's serious. He ain't lying about that. It's on picture. Yeah. He ain't lying about that. He went up there. Now, will it come out? Yeah, it's coming out. It'll be out. Yeah, that's that's serious, man. That's real serious. <laughs> real serious, man. Whatever so. he said, I I don't know. Yeah. But I'm, I'm pretty sure he really went up there. Because he on a picture with him. He yeah. went up there. Yeah. He got a picture of him sitting down, like, doing the interview. Yeah, people would do anything for money. If that if that happened, okay, people would so, do anything yeah, for money, so, man. So how I'm, you know they won't get you happened, lined I'm up sure, for no money? I'm, I'm, if that happened, I'm sure Adam gave him a bag. But he did. I, I, look, man, I'm all about facts. I'm all about let me see it before I start to judge it and have something to say about it. I'm not saying a little preview of this or that didn't come out, but we'll see if an interview really come out. I hope that it doesn't. But at the end of the day, man, you know, going 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 back a little bit. I hope that all of y'all could resolve y'all situation. I, I thought y'all did. You know, you went over there on back on Fig. You know, uh, uh, you, you were speaking. Oh, you, you no talked issues. about how you and Smack was cool. Smack wasn't there, but everything seemed cool. No you know, issues. and cordial and everything. You know, so I'm just hoping that y'all could. You know, because let me tell you this. This is what we always got to remember. Y'all can make more money. I'm telling this to you, T. Real Smack. Y'all can make more money together than apart. That's a fact. You know, y'all, y'all, y'all. The numbers that y'all had. Well, Smack wasn't there. But the numbers is bigger than if you're doing something by yourself. So that's the thing that we don't always remember and think about in our community. That's why we see all these other people that, that come from there and come from there. They, they, they balling and booming because they didn't build businesses. They, they stick together and all of that. Y'all come from the same hood. But, but, same but, community. Same community. But y'all can't do nothing together. N- n- understanding and knowing, because I know deep damn y'all know, y'all will make more money. Y'all all popping on YouTube. Y'all make more money together. But it just don't make no sense. So I just hope that y'all well, can resolve it in a way where it's like, hey, let's get this bread two days out the week because we can. When you grow up in LA, you feel me? When you grow up in LA and you young, you be. Seeing I grew it. up in LA. I know. <laughs> so, no, I'm saying when yeah. you grow. I'm, that's what I'm saying. When you growing up in LA or wherever, you see them old, them, them OGs or them, them people that's already a little older. They doing most of their dealings with their enemies. Yeah. People that from the other side or stuff like that because yeah. it just seemed to never work bro with, with with people that you grew up with or, or that's your family low-key it just don't work bro we gotta fix that though man we gotta fix that you know i'm gonna stand on that i'm i'm gonna as, as long as you see paul p in the youtube space in, in the social media or media space period i'm gonna always speak on that because guess what the door's been open in my world. When I was younger and before I got into business, I didn't really understand when it came down to what's really going on out here. When I got into business and started to see what's going on inside of these corporations, built my own, started to see the cultures that's doing this and doing it, doing that and how they're doing it. Who's buying up the hospitals? Who's buying up all the property? Who's buying up these buildings? Who own the sports arena? Crypto, crypto who's owning these, in, these entities, right? And I started to see as individuals who stick together that come from these same communities that stick together 
together, lined up together, is those individuals, whether they like each other or not, they stick together. They come together. Those are the ones who's running everything. That's when I really saw it ain't nothing we ever going to be able to do out here unless we figure that out. It ain't about figuring out. We know how to make money. We know we got talent. You know what I'm saying? We, we, we survivors. We know and understand all of that. But we can't figure out how to come together when it had to do with the benefit of the community and the benefit of our families and people around us. That's a problem. So I'm going to speak on it. And I'm never going to stop speaking on it. Because if we figure that out, it's over. It's over. And you know, and I'm going to tell people this now. Yes, I include and say milk because you come from the same communities we came from. You know, you was raised by a black mother, you know, and everything like that. So I'm I'm, I'm going to I'm going to speak on that when I talk about communities involving you because you come from those same communities. So when it come down to it, we got to figure that part out. If we figure that part out, everything else is already solved. Everything else we already been doing it. We just so divided. And that's a problem, man. That's a problem. You know, so. I'm never gonna stop speaking on that milk. I got to. That's why I'm here. You know, to 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 show the world we come from. Hey, when it come down to building and business and and all of those, that's the way. That's the way out. That's the way on how to build and and grow where you coming from. Entrepreneurship, starting your own business, grouping up within it because you can't do nothing by yourself. That's the way. You know, I'm here for that. And hey, but we got to do it together too. You know, this right here didn't just come just from me just walking in this building. No, it came from, you know, having individuals that I could work with and team up with. You know, you see Big Don in the back. You know, some people like uh, uh, my Uncle Bobby that came and helped put stuff together. My brother. You know, you see Amarachi. You see a lot of individuals it took to make this happen and make this be able to run. No matter who put in 10%, 5%, whatever. We came together to make it run the way it's running. And you can't do anything unless we come together like that. I'm just saying when it comes down to y'all individuals, y'all may be doing your own thing and making money, but y'all can make millions monthly if y'all figure out how to come together. I promise you that if y'all figured it out. Y'all y'all missing out on a lot of bread just by not doing that. That's all I'm saying. That's a fact, so. Um, I, you know what I want to jump in, jump into right now, man. And uh, you spoke on it a little bit earlier, but a lot of people speaking on you buying fake views and, and, and you lost 9 million views because you purchased them and, you know, and everything like that, you know, uh, we've talked about views and everything and how hard it is to get them. And we've even talked about people who do purchase them. But when it comes down to, to, to you, where is people getting this information and, and what are they talking about with you losing all these views and everything? Well, <clears throat> I I deleted videos. So if I delete videos, I lose views. If you delete the videos off your channel, the, the views don't stay there. And I, I do reactions, bro. Um, a lot of them videos was old. A lot of them was older. Um, they just wasn't done right, bro. But I can't, I'm not, if I bought subscribers, then I'll be on YouTube for no reason. And then where would I be like I I don't I don't do nothing all day really like I don't work. So <laughs> we're bro, they going to say whatever they say. They just can't understand how I could just delete these videos and lose 9 million views cuz views is everything to them. So So they was basically looking at your back end and they saw that hey, it, it, you know, Milk had, you know, 10 million views, you know, like, and, and now it's 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 a uh, a million views. So so it's something that's they, they looking at your numbers for yeah. real, for real. Yeah, but okay, but if they would have been looking at my channel, it would have said I had I went from like 530 videos to like 240 mm. or something. Would have said that. I had like 500 videos, bro. Yeah. A lot of them was old, and I'm saying a lot of them was on the same person, maybe different reactions, like 10 of them on this person. 10, okay. Let's just say if I had 15 videos on Crip Mac, you deleted a lot 13 of them. 13 of them got to go. Okay. Yeah, what is 15 of them on there for? And like, okay, and like if I got, let's just say if I had 15 reactions of different No Jumper videos, 14 of them, got they got to go. The ones that's, especially if they ain't making no dough. If they ain't made no dough in a, in, in, in a month, what is, they got to go, bro. It's like, they oh. But yeah, I just did that to clean house. Like all the old videos that didn't make no sense, Every other video that was on there is still on there. Uh, 
Yeah, but they just can't fathom that shit. They don't understand it. But anybody that do YouTube, it's a difference between having a video on private and deleting it. Because if you have a video on private, it still can be um, striked mm -hmm. or uh, flagged or anything. Yeah, it could still that shit could still happen. So you gotta delete videos. You have they wasn't it wasn't right, bro. But yeah, if you can't, it's no way that I could be on YouTube. Now yeah. I don't know what people doing on Instagram, TikTok, none of that shit. But I'm on YouTube, and it is an income. Yeah, and uh, I couldn't get an income buying fake views or whatever. Yeah, no, I don't need yeah. to do that. Yeah, I mean, I do. I do want people who probably don't understand YouTube to know. I mean, th that don't really mean nothing. If you already, if you already had the, if they weren't bought, yeah, I get it. If they were bought, but if you already made your money from the views, you're not going to make your money again unless the video that continue to go viral or something like that. If it ain't continue to go viral Let's and the numbers are, are stagnant and not moving, then then yeah, you you might as well take the videos down. It don't matter. It don't mean nothing. You're not gonna make no more money. You ain't gonna lose no money. So yeah, if if that's the case and they were not purchased. Yeah, it, it, that don't matter. That don't mean nothing. You know, your subscribers are going to still say the same, but don't take away from my that. Subscribers you know? have, my subscribers have never changed. It never changed drastically in yeah. numbers. It never fluctuate. It just go up, bro. It has never yeah. went down uh, drastically. Like, no shit like that. It's just a lot of them videos, they had to go. And then a lot of them was limited. Yeah. Okay. okay, so let's just say I got total 50 limited videos. Mm -hmm. Now that's stopping. Well, that's making the process for the newer videos. It's making it harder to get uh monetized. Yeah. So now it's taking longer to get monetized. So it's like if they ain't doing shit in the yellow, they really had to go, bro. And then it was like a bunch of nobodies. Like all my videos is on there, bro. It was just the the video if it was too many videos of the same shit you gotta go yeah and that's a fact that's something house. that i had to do that to my own channel you know um a lot of the old limited videos was making my newer videos no matter what was on there you know get that little strike to where i had to like you know the yellow dollar sign to where i had to get it reviewed for them to then change it back to the green dollar sign so you have to you might as well delete those videos that have those limited views and everything like that on it because it's going to mess up your channel when it come down to new videos so now nah, you 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 right when it come down to that you know uh but, but but you but you know what people are going to do on youtube when people going back and forth with you or don't like you oh you know no he lost he buying fake views you know da, 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 da. sometimes i mean i know you don't care to do that but sometimes you just got to maybe Hey, hey, play your cards. Show those analytics. Show us, show, show that, show us being, you know, that money that's going in the bank. If you want to do that, I ain't I'm not. My money. Yeah, yeah, I'm not. I'm not saying that matter, but sometimes <laughs> you got analytics. No, no, they I'm know, saying, but they, you, but, yeah, yeah, but I'm just, wherever, I'm not saying, but you can't, you but can't see exactly, but you look, can see people can see what you're making. You wherever, know that, right? Yes. Wherever okay, they look, okay, that's all I'm wherever saying. Wherever they yeah. seen them views or wherever they think they seen that shit at, that should tell them wherever that got analytics and all that. Yeah, yeah. But I'm gonna tell you that shit. That that but that ain't gonna go viral. It's not. Yeah, but talking about that. But that's where they can look at. The same place that they look in to see the views got deleted. I mean, the view, the, it ain't even views got deleted. I don't even know where this is coming from. It just say negative 9 million views. And my channel had 500. I think I got screenshots of of my channel. It had like 560 videos. Yeah. I deleted like at least upwards of 300 videos. I yeah. clean house. I had to. I don't. I don't give a fuck what they say. Like them making videos on me just give me more subscribers, give me more views. Then you got to think about this. I don't need. I don't have to buy views. I've been putting in work. I've been putting in work for years, so I get views. I got subscribers. I got, you know, uh, shit like that. A lot of them people that be making them videos about me don't get views. They don't got subscribers. They're not getting no traction. They nothing is going on for them. But you know, it's just weird, bro. But I really don't care. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When they, if, <laughs> but it's just crazy because the same place that show the negative views, they can see whatever else they want. So I don't know, bro. But like I said, you know, <laughs> people are always going to pick the part that they know people are going to listen to because it's confrontation. It's something that stirs issues and, and, and make a, you know, create chaos and back and forth. You know those I are do? the things that people are going to you know talk about because those are the things that people are going to watch and it's going to go viral. Oh, they, lifetime, oh, they saying milk is. It, I screenshot it, my lifetime. Views. I screenshot my lifetime revenue. 
You know, and I can even I could go down. That's what you should do. There I you could go. screenshot that show, shit. Show them something. And and I screenshot the 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 lifetime revenue. Yeah. I could I could, see I got receipts. Yeah. I go show. I got every you know every direct deposit that come or whatever. You get an email, right? Or you could no, not an email, but you go to the uh, you could go on the website and it show you every deposit that came yeah. from Google AdSense. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's the thing too. I ain't that, worked in. That, I have not worked in twenty nine months or something like that, bro. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna just say thirty four. Uh. So they saying I'm buying fake views. Yeah, okay. They try everything they could to knock the Gilligan Slayer down, but it don't work. Yeah. They all go down, all of them. Cause God don't like that ugly shit, and all all every one of them that tried me and say some goofy shit, it end up going some end up going bad for them. I'm just saying, mm. it really do. Every single one of them. Yeah, that's the thing that I can't say though. When it come down to it, you can't lie on YouTube when it come down to numbers. Like it, it shows your analytics. It shows what you making. So the numbers don't lie. So if it show what you making lifetime, I mean, you can't make that up. You know, so. I mean, it's easy to prove, but you know, people are gonna pick the side that that create controversy. You know, because that's, that's cool. what create that's what goes viral. Yeah, you but feel I, me? I don't, but you know, I don't, I don't. but when it comes down to, I want to see whether I, I don't believe that you ever bought anything, I right? I, I I don't I don't I don't I don't think so. I, I'm, it's I, no point. I, I know what's up, right? But I want to say, well, uh, the people, people in the chat, you know, y'all think milk is buying views, man? What y'all what y'all what y'all think? Y'all think milk is over here? You know, uh uh uh, uh purchasing. Purchasing views on YouTube to stay relevant, bro. Me and Adam. <laughs> nah, but I know you not, man. I just want to see what the people gonna no say. But I know what's up. Beefing for like twenty four months straight, beef. Yeah, that's views. around the time you that's went a five to the. Million, um, that's a five million four. Yeah, four almost five million subscribers. A four million subscriber channel, uh -huh. and they going back and forth with me. I bought buy views for what? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and I'm doing interviews with 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 pages with million subscribers mm. five views for what everybody making videos about me what do i gotta buy views that's for? a fact i saw that myself i was like man we gotta give what's going on man what's going on with milk man everybody got something to say right now you know I mean, when they it comes down that, to milk that's cool i love it though i'm not even gonna lie i love the free promo the 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 free relevancy i love it it's yeah, cool yeah. keep me it's just I even saw the bit. In fact, I, I got sent. You know, I saw a video of uh, the homie. Um, shout out to the homie Munchie B, who was here uh, a little while ago. But um, he was on. You know, he got. You know, they got their own thing on Streets TV, and he was speaking on people who say they're not gonna go back to No Jumper end up going back. And he spoke on that in regards to you, and was talking about how you know you say what you say in regards to No Jumper, but eventually you probably gonna end up going back. So I was like, well. Why don't you speak on that yourself? Could you see yourself ever going back on no jumper? Ever. Ever again? I mean, if... if Uh-oh! Yeah. Uh-oh! Hold up! You know we... Hey, you know how long we've been doing this show, right, Milk? You know! <laughs> you know how many episodes so, we have. And you know what you said. So, so let's see. I'm going to say that again. Do you see yourself ever going back on no jumper, Milk? It can happen. But not... Wow! Not, not not me going on there to. to you was right, Munchie. Not, my bad. Not, That's on me. Not, my bad. It, it can happen. <laughs> it can happen. He just better be thankful he got on there. That's all that is. I always say after you come here, you going on back. You going on a jumper. Hey, hey, no, hold up, hold up. This is a proven fact. I wish the bro was here, and Big Don to tell you too. This is a proven fact. I even did a clip on this. If you come to the Nothing to Some podcast. Oh my mama, Adam22 is going to call you, and you will be on No Jumper within a month. That's a fact. Everybody that came here, and I told them that they laughed. But guess what? In under a month, they was on No Jumper. You better believe, hey, Adam22 liked the sauce. It's all good. Me, I don't got to go on no nowhere. I don't get, I, t I slay all these people who got something to say about this podcast, got something to say about me. I don't need nobody's platform. So I'm going to call out what the fact is. And the fact is, Adam is trying to take the sauce, even though they got way more subs than over here. So if you come on here, you will get a call from No Jumper. I just had to point that out. But go back to what you were saying. And Munchie did tell me that you would say that too. But go back to what you were saying. Yeah, um, Munchie B had been left a comment on No Jumper and was like, uh, whatever, 
And I've been saying Adam, like, why you can't interview him or whatever, but when he didn't want to interview him saying this shit about the Draco shit. But if I did go on there, I could go on there and 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 uh and 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 and, and have a uh a, a, a sit down with him and talk about this shit. That don't mean that I'm about to be his friend or that I'm about to work for him or I'm about to work up there. I don't mean nothing like that. If I did go up there one time to 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 speak what I got to say and, and him having them people up there lying on my name and all that shit, I could go do that. I put the pressure on him. But you know but what nobody, you said in the past, though, yeah, though right? Okay, I just so, want to make, let's just be clear, though. Let's yeah, just be clear. Yes, but I'm no. And then it's okay. Hey, I always say, look, this is what I said. Even when the other individuals said, I said, man, go get your back. You may, no, you may no, get it. Hold on, let me, I'm not, let me finish real quick. I told individuals, man, you may get a check. I'm a businessman. You get that call, you better go over there. Five million subs, right? So, so I'm with it, right? No, but I'm saying you, you let's stand on you, let's stand not, on the facts. You I did am not say that, going right? up there to be no worker. I'm not going. Not to a work. worker. If I'm going up there to sit down and talk about these people and then talk about him, nobody else like Munchie B didn't even give a fuck about none of the shit he was doing. But he never said I he would not go pressure. to no jumper though. Yeah, I'm but, just saying yeah. you sat here at this table. Yeah, I said multiple it. times yeah. and said I would never go on yeah. no jumper. Well, people say a lot of stuff. People are okay. lying about my name. I I could go down there and you. sit down, but that don't okay. mean I'm about to be working with him. Wow. Or I'm okay. about to have a friendship. That's if I do. That's yeah, yeah. if this do happen. But the door is open now. It's 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 been they've been asking me. It was asking me seven months ago. I know they was that you you spoke no, on that. No, no, no. But it's changing. They 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 they, they milking you a little bit. No, no, they ain't milking me. <laughs> a little bit, little, nah. you know. Warming you up a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, milk. Come on, milk, a little bit. Nah. And, you know, you changing that one, a little bit, milk. Nah, it's more, Come it's more, on, it's, milk. It's more, milk, be real, it's brother. More, it's more of art of war. That's, that's more, that's all I'm going to say about that. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's nothing personal. Oh, it's all business, but it's more of art of war. Okay. People, people don't. I'm not worried about what Munchie B saying. He he needs to worry about doing his little videos it, over there. And that's what I'm saying. It wasn't um, well, you know, everybody talk about it. That that's the one thing that I like that Bosco say. Shout out to the homie Bosco. Everybody talk about everybody. So no, that. anybody to say like, oh, this person everybody I'm talk about everybody. Nothing, I'm you know not what I'm saying? saying? Nothing about him, bro. But yeah, yeah. nobody nobody going nobody care about none of the shit I was saying about him anyway. About the pressure I was putting on him. Nobody, nobody was care. I'm not saying you, but I'm just saying in general from all the shit I seen, mm -hmm. nobody cared about that shit. You talking about pressure on who? On Adam, Adam about all the shit he was doing. Nobody cared yeah. about that shit. Of course, you know nobody. Look, when it come down when to, they got to that, lying on my name, this I, is, I'm this gonna is, go up there. I'm not. Getting, it's social media. It's YouTube. Nobody really care about all of that stuff and who did what. When it come down to it, I call stuff out because it's is the truth. But it's also fun. I don't care what nobody feel to think about me, Paul Pete. Hey, I just kept it. I keep it authentic. I keep it real. What I say sometimes may come off the wrong way, but if people really said what was truly in their head, they'll come off the way I come off. I just don't hold back. I say the truth. I say what it is. You know, you know that little thing in our brain that sometimes say, don't say that. Don't go there. I say that. I go there. So that's why I'm saying at the end of the day, you're right. People don't care about what's real. People don't care about what's right. I, I'll say something that's a fact and they'll still take the bigger platform side all day. It is what it is. I just brought this up because I was on the other side of it saying, nah, he would never go over there. No matter what. You, you got to go get a bag in a bag. But I was like, nah, I'm milk not, wouldn't do that. I'm not getting, milk wouldn't do that. I'm not getting a bag. That's all I'm saying. That's what people think. I'm not. If I did go up there, I'm not getting no money. So Adam ain't even going to give a bag? Like, I don't. On. I don't want. If I was going up there, I never been. I'm not. I, I never even talked to Adam. I haven't talked to him. I mean, I have conversations with Flacco. But if you go there, you gon' you you most likely sitting down with Adam. Of you know course. That. Okay. Just making sure. Like, you're not finna go to no jumper after all of that and not sit with Adam. I that don't, is the that's, whole, yeah, that's yeah. the whole thing if I did go up there, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I feel, I feel. Why, I'm not going to go up there and who else would I go up there and sit down with? Well, I was wrong. You know what I'm saying? I was wrong on that one. That's all I got to say. I was wrong. Even though, hey, do what you got to do, though. You know, hey, more mo props to you. You know what I'm saying? Do what you got to do. But I was wrong. You know what I'm saying? I was definitely wrong on that one. So you got me on that one. You got me on that one. <laughs> you know what I want to do a little bit before we go into the next one? We'll see, we'll see what the chat's saying a little bit, man. You know, uh, usually when me and Milk have our conversations, we never, uh, you know, it's, it's not, we don't really do the lives too much. Main, mainly it'd be unlisted. Uh, but let, let's see what the chat's saying. Read off some of uh, what, they, what they got to say out there. So uh, you pulling it up, Big Don? 
Yes, sir. We got the first one up now. Show for show. Sean Tyreek Watson. He was lying, didn't believe for a second. G face acting goofy. Shout out to Sean Tyreek Watson. You know, uh, what you got to say about that? You got anything to say? Uh, he, he already know the script. Sean, yeah. Sean know the script. He know yeah. he's goofy. Yeah. Gilligan face. Man. That's his name, G face. Gilligan face. <laughs> A Z N double O seven G face cap, man. They with you, milk. Cause he cap. G face cap. They know he cap. Yeah, they 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 definitely with you. Uh, Ben Ben, this brother channel dope jumped up to it subscription, man. Appreciate appreciate that, Ben. Definitely jumped up on it. Definitely appreciate that. Uh, Marsfield Lime G face remind me of Wes Watson, just full of it. L O L all hype. Yeah, they 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 not they not feeling G face at all. Z-face. They not feeling G face at all. Bro, they they with you for real for real. Bro, you know. Like, and like I said, if the dude, I don't know. I know my experience with G face. Like I said, it was the things that he said he we could do for trucking. Just to, cause me, look, me, I'm a humble cat when it come down to business. I like. Money. Let me finish. I'm very humble when it comes to business. I want to learn. So I don't care if nobody say, oh, why are you reaching? No, no, no. I'm not like that. I will reach out to you if it's something I can learn because I, I, I want to I wanna make a billion, right? So so I want to learn. So if somebody's saying they could, they, they could do this, they could do that, and it's a new industry to me, I'm going to reach out. Anything that he said, did I get anything from that? No, but I did get into the game. Three trucks later, I'm in it. I'm in it. So so did I did – I, well, am I here to be able to say, oh, nah, G-Face is real. I was able to, you know, get this type of experience from, from, from you know, what he doing. No. So, I, he could straight up be lying, you know, and he could be a liar. I don't know. I didn't have an experience with him because he didn't reach out and say anything, you know. But um, it looked like the people feel like, yeah, G-Face is full of it, just like what you said. And also, like I said, if the dude is lying about saying I went to his house. Man, that you need you need a mental check. You know what I'm saying? You, you need, need one, some therapy. You need some help. You, you need, need to be admitted th- in a program Bro, you need to one, literally period. help your brain stems. Like, cause that's too much. That's that's a whole nother level. Saying I went to somebody's house and I spoke to them. You straight up talked about the conversation that y'all had. How can you create a conversation when nobody was there talking to you? But you know, like, what are you serious? Bro, if you look at that shit, Th- that's too much right there, the bro. Story wasn't too even much. The same. Look, he one of them went on uh back on fit. One of who? One of the people that. He well, claimed, that. Young baller, milk is the realest. Hey, they with you, milk. They with it, you, bro. man. So what was you saying? One of the individuals that, that claimed he was with uh uh Gilligan Face went on back on fit. They had him on back on fit. Who? One who, of the individuals. who exactly? Uh, his name is. I don't know, Baby Sassy or something. Uh, I don't know. I don't okay. even know. But they had him on there, bro, and his story was different. So it's just nothing is lining up, bro. That people know. Mm. I did reactions to all that shit. Uh, yeah, they just tell lies, tell stories. But it's okay. Cause uh, yeah. You gotta if if you tell one lie, you gotta tell a lot of lies. Oh yeah. And you gotta keep up with that lie. Yeah, yeah. And they can't do that, and they on uh, liquid heroin and uh. Smoking, they can't even, bro. They can't keep up. They, <laughs> they, they gonna get caught and they lie. But yeah, yeah, yeah man, I'm telling you, bro. If you go, do hopefully, they research, didn't go that far with it, though, man. I mean, if you ask me, do it sound like a lie? I sit here and say it sounds like a lie. But I give people the benefit of. I'm all about. I'm all about action and seeing what the facts I'm all are. About I, 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 you know, I can have an opinion like everybody else. My opinion, are you lying? Absolutely not. I want evidence. But, but that's what I'm saying. That's what I want to see the facts behind it. I want to see what it really is. You know, so uh, a uh, true composer, milk always been the truth. They rocking with you, milk. Bro, every, they rocking with you, milk. Bro, every rapper, they rocking with you, milk. Every rapper that gets caught <laughs> or somewhere, they yeah, getting yeah. recorded. Remember the yeah. dude with the little arm in the airport, and he caught like um one of Yo Gotti artists uh-huh. and hit him. He got like a little arm, and he had the phone. Yeah, yeah, and he recorded that himself. Yeah. So when they catch people and they want them, they're gonna record. Yeah, if you want it, you gonna get clout. it. Yeah, you gonna get it. You know, Curtis Keller, is this a monologue? No, oh, man, this is we just here chopping it up, man, doing what we do like we always, man. That's about it, you know. But um, if, if I'm obviously obviously you think we doing something right, so I mean, it's the energy. One thing I can say about milk, I like I like milk energy because uh. Me and Milk could go have a conversation, totally disagree, 
chop it up, laugh, shake hands. Next, we talking about something different the next time. So I love conversation with Milk because it's nothing personal. It's just us having a good time, chopping it up at the table. You know, so it's always gonna have that natural feeling. You know, with with us because uh, you know, we just hey, we just chop it up, man. That's about it. It's like grown, you man. know. Yeah, that's it. Do. That's it. You know. So. Uh, um, but. Yeah, bro. So I don't be worried about them lies because they gonna tell them. But yeah. that's like a cold lie, and people know, bro, because he never got an interview nowhere else. Yeah. Off of that shit. Yeah. So it's <laughs> it'd be funny, bro. But if it's no way, I called you all that. You called me at my house and it's no footage, none. Yeah. You didn't have a phone holding it, like even looking at you recording me talking or something. Yeah. Stop it. Yeah. No, I feel you, man. I mean, we, you know, we'll, we'll see if this continue to get taught. I mean, they was talking about it for a minute, you know, that's so dead. we'll see if that's dead, you know. That, that was shit. it for the chat. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah, for that, sure, for sure. That, that shit dead, bro. He um, is dead. He's, he's, he's nothing, bro. He, he's a fucking liar with nothing to back up nothing. Yeah, yeah. Just probably with the truck and shit, too, bro. He got four, how, he, how do he got 400,000 <laughs> subscribers, bro? I mean, followers on Instagram. I'm still trying to figure this out, bro. And then I don't trust them pages that you when said, you go to their followers. You said probably with the truck and stuff. Probably making it all up, huh? Yeah. All up. Yeah. I mean, shit. I don't trust shit. So I see it. Oh, I man. I got to see some shit. I need, I need uh, evidence. You can... You he be, be doing this little video. He got, you don't I believe don't he got, the bread ain't coming from the trucks. You don't believe that, man? Man, that, that shit, it. man, that could be what coming from think? the public. <laughs> <laughs> I know that shit could be fake. I, I don't know. G Face, he say, man, you ain't really getting that truck and bread, man. He say, you ain't really getting that truck and bread, brother. Come on, man. What's up, know, man? Show some love. You not getting that truck and bread. That's from the police. That's what you said, Bill. <laughs> they, they, they. <laughs> you know, in California and these different states, they be paying people. I'm not saying it's him, but. No, it could be shit. I be thinking, I, I look at people oh, like, damn, man. you, you posting That's all this messed money. Up. If you posting all this money and I don't know nothing, like if say if say if I was your homie or if I knew about you and you posting all this money on your Instagram, yeah, I should know what you doing low key in the streets or something. Yeah, like I should know like oh they oh no they say he a flocker or whatever or something like that. Even though you could still be the law, but it would just be people coming out of nowhere with stacks of money. Want people and he's just doing that to manipulate people's minds. That I really never get, man. You would never ever catch me. Because he's showing to, no money on Instagram, twenty to, never, bro. He wants you to be like, I don't, oh, even, I, I don't, I don't even like to carry off, cash. I, 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 I got cards, man. I ain't trying to do none of that. He you wants know? some friends that'll say, I'll crash out for him because he yeah. got this money and he ain't really giving me nothing like that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shit is crazy. Hey man, the other day, man, you over there calling AD a party crip, man. What's 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 up? I that thought shit, you know. Bro. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> the la- the, the you last because hey, you in the phrases, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I mean, bro, that did you see you him sitting on that party floor, crib, though? man? What are we call He you? was sitting on the floor. I thought, with I thought, thought AD was cool. I thought everything was straight, yeah, man. Yeah, we be playing. I mean, we, we call cool. party crib, man. You know, you ain't taking this. You ain't taking this crib as serious, bro. Bro, you I'm not. It. I'm not like you know. Shit, I, I get party. call stuff, so I gotta call people shit back. <laughs> you ain't taking AD serious. That's messed up, nah, man. I fuck you with know, AD, AD on really the low. do his thing, I, man. I, I, I like with, AD. Look, I'm gonna be very honest with you. I fuck with AD. The only yeah. shit that happened between us is it's really it, it, shit only start happening with us because of Adam. Like that was the real, <laughs> that was the problem. Cause yeah. I never had an issue with him. Yeah, yeah. I never had an issue with nobody at. Uh, that place up there. You just be basically defending yourself. You know, you just hey, no. You the know, problem, with, you... the problem was with the owner. Oh. And then once I keep, I'm getting into it with the owner, you know, eventually I guess that's when problems start with the other people. You know, it yeah, because like, you was you was actually going on their shows at first. Well, I never been on his show. Okay. We I I never did that one yet, but um. It, it was never no issue, bro. We still ain't. It's not really no issue. It ain't like I'm trying to kill him and he trying to kill me. Nah, come on, man. It's nothing like that, that bro. Ain't, that ain't YouTube, man. It's not. You know, at the at, I'm, I'm just I'm having fun with it, man. Just asking, what was it about? Because I know too, you when it come down to the phrases and the names, you know, that's just what yeah, you do. Party you know, girl, bro. it was that just shit funny. Was funny. Man. <laughs> I mean, at the moment, that's what I came. 
Yeah. I was looking at the shit or something, and it just came to my head like party crib. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that ain't taking nothing. You could, you still got party crips. That's you know, but that shit. That's what came up in my head, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but at the end of the day, like you, you feel like the real one, though. You know, like cool dude, everything. Yeah, like that. Okay, yes, okay, bro. yeah, yeah. Like yeah. I'm not trying to knock him down. I don't, I don't be thinking about. I want to see him. Like, uh, tweaked out and dead, or I want nothing to happen. I ain't yeah. thinking, like, nah, hell no, nah, he's doing good. Yeah, I've been with saying that AD was been supposed to leave, uh, the most Gilligan podcast in the world. Oh, yeah, we're speaking on that for a minute. You I know? was saying that shit before he, even, yeah, um, man, bro, like, I've been saying that, so yeah, like, it yeah. ain't really nothing, bro. It's just the, the with me going at Adam and getting to it with Adam, you know, eventually, I guess it become casualty at war. We eventually don't cross paths but well i think it would really did it was when his brothers or stepbrother did that interview with sharp bro and mm. i did a reaction to that shit and i don't think it would never be cool because of that yeah gotcha, gotcha but i didn't say nothing i mean i didn't say nothing bad i don't say nothing on youtube like nothing crazy i ain't never dissed nobody mamas and dead homies yeah. but it's just the top the the video and, yeah. and what the uh subject was and I think that's what it be when it come down to 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 you. Now, one thing I I I'll give to you, no matter how many individuals is coming at you one by one, you'll get it all of them by yourself. I give you that. Yeah. But I do gotta say, a lot of times it may be your reaction videos though so, nah. that get people stirred up nah, I, because 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 look, no, when I said of course video, you're just reacting. No, when I said the but video, you are bro, talking about those nah, individuals. When I said the video, you know I wasn't talking about him or the brother. It was. I was doing a reaction to the interview that the brother did on No Jumper with Sharp. I was reacting to that about, you know, that and the part about him, what he went to prison for. Yeah, yeah. That's all I reacted to. And what you said was all, was it all positive? Oh, yeah, you know, that really happened in prison. He a good dude. He cool. You you know you weren't talking nah. about. Exactly. Well, because so the, that's what I'm saying. Wait, what wait. do you think? Because you the, video, the video wasn't, the video, you, the video, the video that I seen, you don't say that. I'm just saying, you don't, if you guys, you, you can't you, say none of that for the the video that I seen, what he said and what he went down for. You don't say none of that. I didn't say nothing bad like that, but it's just me. Period. If I do the reaction, everybody gonna see it. Everybody gonna see it, and I'm just saying, you think people ain't gonna have nothing to say about it though, milk? That's all I'm well, saying. I, well, I didn't care about that, bro, because of the person, what he went to jail for. I didn't care about that. That's some weird shit. <laughs> yeah, so I wasn't worried about that, bro. I don't really want to say it on the stream, but you know, it was some crazy shit. It was like, say, a security guard at a ninety-nine at a uh, bargain store or something, general discount, and yeah. that's in a parking lot, and kids walk through this parking lot to go to school or something or, or shit like that. But it was a security guard working at some shit like that, and uh, I guess he got caught. Through like one of them little apps they was using back then, I forgot the exact app, but like where people go to date and shit. I, I think it was Tinder well, match, or some match. shit, or match or, or Tinder <laughs> or some shit like Tinder maybe. E Harmony. No, I want E Harmony. It was like Tinder or something. I don't know, but he got caught on there trying to uh, get get a minor to be a three hundred four, like in a sting operation okay. type of shit. So I just reacted wow. to that, bro, but. That's really what it is. It ain't really no smoke. Like I said, I'm not trying to. I'm if I see him in public, I mean it ain't like if if it's an issue or whatever. But it's not gonna be like I'm trying to pull out a um nothing and I'm not. You know I would never. Yeah. No shit like that. But I mean people. This is what I'm saying. If it's on the internet, bro, and the video is like whatever, you can't get mad at me for giving my opinion. Yeah, no, I'm not saying that anybody can get mad. But they, but, but, but people you gotta probably expect, do get mad. But you gotta expect. Yeah, people get mad. Well, but if I'm it's just a saying, rapper and I'm then just, you snitch and I'm then just, I talk about the paperwork, look, I'm just saying you gotta expect that somebody gonna say something back if you react and have yeah, something to say. I That's, don't care yeah, about yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Like I never did that. I don't so it's necessarily at the end of the day, ain't people just going at you though too? Well, no, the time a lot of them. It's people too that you reacting to certain mm. things. And they that's, just that's said a, something about it. That's a small percentage of them. But in the beginning... 50-50 at least, ma milk. Majority of the videos that I've ever seen, I have never even mentioned these people. It's mm -hmm. it's people that I can say now that I didn't even know of that made 20 or 30 videos about me. Not the people that you speak on. Though. Never People that you on. speak on, though, you know when it comes down to these individuals, you are normally reacting to their videos. The, the T-Rails, the Smacks, the ADs, the... 
uh, uh, or they saying babies, shit about me. You, like, yeah. yeah, but when I be reacting to that shit, sometimes most of the time they be mentioning me, or if not, it's some other shit, like whatever. But yeah. Yeah, and I'm just saying. Sometimes you, I'm me. just saying. Sometimes you probably can't look at it though. Like, oh, they all just attacking you and they coming at you. But I, I never mean, said it's, it's they back and forth. Me. Yeah, I really yeah. don't care about them attack. I don't yeah, give a yeah, fuck yeah, about yeah. that because I can handle that. Like, yeah. I can handle them coming at me. I love nah, that. Of course not. Nah, nah. That's content yeah, for me. Is, yeah. is 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 work and I can handle it. Cause, yeah, because you know, uh, all of your them, bills. I get it. It all of them. I didn't already. You know, brick baby. I didn't already did what I didn't said. What about him, bro? No, <laughs> but shit, I I don't care about that, bro. But but most of them people still it be it be really stemming from somebody saying something to me, yeah. or if it's something that like a reaction, and I might not even say nothing that bad. Like I don't, but people still don't like you to even give your opinion on shit. That's yeah. just how it go. They don't, you know, they don't like that. But That's it is sweet. what it is. You don't like people don't like people watch the news. They ain't trying to like do nothing to the news crews. The yeah. newscast and all them people. So, I mean, it is what it is, bro. Like, long as I'm not on here, um, wilding out, really, you know, crazy. I don't really, I don't, I don't be that crazy on the reactions. But it's not my fault if you a rapper and then you get on a video and then you slip up and say some shit or you didn't did some shit. Yeah. And they expect me not to like at least say my opinion. Yeah. No. At the end of the day, it's all entertainment. You know. I, I like I said earlier. You know. I would like. I would like to see some individuals though. Hey, come together every once in a while. Though. You know. Do a little collaboration. I mean. I, I get it. People making more money talking about each other and everything like that. But think about how dope it would be. You know what I'm saying? Even <laughs> someone like a. I don't think we'll ever see it, but. <laughs> You know how 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 viral that'll be if, if maybe you you a, you a brick y'all y'all sat down and just chopped it up and even you know what I'm saying whatever I'm not saying that would happen I'm just saying that if you could look and think about the dollars that would be made yeah but not with him if you saw situations like that I'm not saying that would happen you know a lot of times I say stuff and I, I you know I see the reaction no, like oh no, that no, wouldn't no. but I'm uh, not no, just with you with others a, too a, I'm just I, saying I'm thinking happen. about I'm see me I'm so business a lot of times but I'm thinking about the money too bro because look because yeah, because this is what I'm thinking too like look I, look to me I ain't taking none of this stuff personal now if you come and you try to you touch me you pull something out on me I got to defend myself. We going this this ain't about no money or nothing no more. This ain't about business no more. See me, my seriousness is on another level. All this stuff is games to me. That's why I'm like, hey, we could come together and and, and, and make more money and, and, and keep things, you know, a, a cordial. You know what I'm saying? Why not? Now we going to another level when you're talking about you want to take my life. That's a different level. I'd rather you know what I'm saying? Like me not oh, if so, look, even look, People, I was asked this before. Would I ever go and sit with um, Adam Twenty Two, whatever? For one, I never said. W would I just nor the casually go do it? Never. For what? But if it was a business opportunity there, and, and money could hundreds of thousands could be made to millions, of course. I'm not stupid. It's this is it's, it's also about money. We got to survive out here, and, and that's where my mind be when it come down to a to the, to this. A lot of times, right? You know. I, that's what I want to see more people do, but but if you was talking about this person want to take my life, that's another level. That ain't about money. That ain't about nothing. That's another level. So I don't take all of this serious. So I ask questions like that because I don't think that you and Brick or you and a uh, 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 T Rail or you and Smack trying to kill each other. You get what I'm saying? So I'm like, why not make money? You get what I'm saying? Why just sit here and and, and just uh, uh, talk from from where y'all at? If y'all y'all know how much more y'all make if y'all came together and did something, much more money could be made. That's why I speak on that. Are y'all gonna do it? Probably never gonna do it. But that's I'm just saying more money could be made. I promise you, if y'all did, that's all I'm saying. Am I wrong about that though? I'm not saying you would do it, but am I wrong about that? Nah, but you know more money could be made. You know it, milk. Yeah, but okay. Nah, I just it could be. Come with, on, it, give that to it, me. It, it just come on. It, it won't be with him. Okay. It's not even just him. It's more of his area. Just it just will not. I don't. No, I just can't do it with anybody. But y'all, I mean, I'm opening to whatever, but yeah. just not with, with with that. Well, you gotta be. You talking about going to sit down with Adam Twenty Two? So you gotta be open or whatever. I'm sure you are <laughs> open or whatever, milk. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But uh, <laughs> hey, milk. You know what I want to ask you, man? I saw you on say cheese, bro, and um. Uh, <coughs> What the, what the, I know Sean, look, I know Sean Cotton be 
capping with those titles. And I didn't look at the whole interview. I just know he be capping. And what are you talking about saying Nick, uh, 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 Milk says he is a nigga. Like, 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 I'm like, I'm like, what? I'm like, is Sean, I know Sean be capping. What is he talking about? Milk said he is a, like, did you just, did you come out and just tell Sean Cotton, hey, Sean Cotton, I am a nigga? Like, what, where did he get that from? What, what? That's like, a, I guess that's the question he asked or he put that as a title. But no, I just didn't say, I didn't come out and say that to him. Okay. Okay. I'm like, what is, I, look, I, I like I said, I know Sean Cotton be capping on those titles a lot of times. I get it. You know, you make a lot of bread. More people watch. But I'm like, I don't think Milk just came out and said, now, no, I, I, can think- under, I can understand if you answer the question like, yeah, I feel more connected to the black community because i come from that i come from that world Bro. my 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 mom's was black you know who raised me and everything like that and and my my girl my kids would be black, all of that he, you know i he can understand that but to say milk he, says milk said i am a nigga that that's a he, that's a whole nother story he asked the question something like that i don't really remember i will have to go look at that shit that shit like five six months old but uh the, I, I don't think the title is Cap. I think he just didn't put... He made it seem... He, it's just the way his title make it seem like I said that. He asked something like that. He didn't just ask that, but it was some question. I, I don't really know what it is, but he put the You know the, the titles be capping, though. He you put know, the titles on. that's... You know that's... They, they, uh, it's Cap. That's gonna make people come look. Exactly. They gonna make, but it's still Cap. <laughs> that's just, all I'm saying. Like is it party. not Cap Milk? It's that's th- a, like, I get it. Sean Cotton, your boy. Is it not Cap it's Milk? It's third party. It's Cap. That's all I'm saying. It, but I think oh he asked God. that question. I think he asked that question, bro. He asked something like that, so I just can't say... He that. said, Milk Cap says is he is a nigga. You straight up said yourself, no, it was maybe worded. I didn't say that. So I'm saying, okay, is the title capping in? It's a it's cap. If you did not straight out say, hey, Sean, I am a nigga, then it's cap. That's if, all if I'm saying. If he asked me that and I said, yeah, then that's probably why he, that's why he would put the title. So like he that asked thing. you in that interview, Milk, are you a nigga? That's what he asked you in that interview, Milk? Yeah. He said straight up, Milk, are you a nigga? <laughs> yeah. So when I watched that interview... Because you know, Milk, I'm going to bring it up. Yeah. It's going to be a part where Sean Cotton says, Milk, are you a nigga? The word nigga and everything. Yeah. All right. I, I don't I, I don't, I don't, believe that. But I watch it. <laughs> I, I watch it. I don't believe that. I get it, though. You've been interviewing over there for a while. You don't believe that's your, it. You that's can your, look at it I don't, I don't believe that Sean Cotton came out and just said just look straight up, it. word for word, Milk, or just ask you. Oh, we're on this question now. Milk, are you a nigga? Look at Like, it. I don't think that that happened that way. I believe that it was a way that he asked you a question that could form into that no. because of what was no. your answer from it. But I don't believe that he just went to question he, number yes, 10 and said, oh, Milk, are you a nigga? Yeah. Like, I don't believe he that said, happened, you, bro. He said, yes. Like, <laughs> yes, he I'm, did. I'm, no, no. Yes, what, what, he did, what's, bro. What's, what's okay. He, bro? You know what? You're going to have me react to that. I'm going to do it. You know what? Just for you <laughs> say that, I'm going to do a reaction. I don't even react care if I get a strike. Because I know Sean Cotton, he connected with YouTube and all nah, the other stuff. I don't strike. care if I'm a stri- I get a strike. I'm going to react to that video. And I'm going to be looking for the part where Sean Cotton went to question number 10. Milk. Are you a nigga? Bro, and he just asked that straight bro, out. Send, I'm gonna be waiting for that one. Bro, I don't send, think he did send, that, but I'm gonna wait for it. I will send you the clip. Send me the clip. Yeah. Like I said, I'm if you don't send me the clip, clip, I'm gonna react to the. I want to see his, him ask exactly that though. He I said don't. I don't want to. I don't. I don't. I don't think that he did that. And I mean, cause I skimmed through the and I didn't see the whole thing. I saw I was watching bro, like why, a minute and a why, half, and but, I skipped. And, but why would I lie about this? I'm not saying that. I just don't believe that he asked you like that. He just said straight that. Up. He said, "We'll do see." You, do you believe that you are n word? All right, so let's do this. If he didn't do that, you'll come over here. You'll come on here and straight up say, "You know what? I was completely wrong." In fact, we'll have an interview in a week from now, and you'll say, "You know what? I was completely wrong." He asked something there, but that ain't what he did. I was completely wrong. You of was course. right, Paul. Uh, of course. You was right, Paul. Of course. But he got to But I guarantee you, uh-huh. I won't be saying that. Okay, but and he remembered. Don't try to form it no, no way. No, no, it's no he way. He got to act like that. Yes. Okay, okay. We'll yes. See. I'm, I'm like I said, I'm, I'm watching that. Oh, he you, pinned, oh, that's my homework for the that. night. I'm watching that, and then I'm gonna react to it the next day, and then you gonna come over here and apologize and say I was wrong. <laughs> that's what you. <laughs>
<laughs> That's Bro, what you're going to okay. do. Straight up. I was yeah. wrong. You you was right. Yo, you, you know? I can't wait to see your face on the reaction. Now, now you know, one part of it, I did agree with you because, you know, we from L.A. Because, um, like I said, I was skimming through it a little bit. And you spoke on how in L.A., in L.A., a lot of the cultures, like, come together. From What I'm talking about from the communities we come from. Yeah. You know, you may have blacks, Hispanics, you know, uh, and stuff like that. You know, we, you know, uh, even the Caucasians that's in some of these communities come together. It ain't no, like, really cr crazy division until you get outside of L.A. When you, when you get to, like, maybe, like, the, the, the Valley, the Lone Beach, you get Different the IE, areas, places yeah. like that. I was going to say, nah, you right about that. You know, when I saw it, I was like, nah, no, nah, right. A lot of people would not understand that yeah. unless you was from L.A., but no, you, you correct about that. You know, like... We went to school with the the Hispanics and, you know, some, some Caucasians and everybody was cool. You know, you have a lot of Hispanics that's from the black gangs, you know, and stuff like that, you know, in L.A. But, see, I also lived in the IE, Riverside, you Come know, on, Moreno man. Valley, you know, uh, uh, Chino, What's and those areas. And in those areas, Ontario. it's a lot of beef between the, the different communities. The Hispanics is fighting with the, the blacks, you know, even in the schools that you go to. You know, it's a lot of that going on, you know. But in L.A., it's not really like that. Really, in L.A., it's about where you from and, you know, issues with the police. You know what I'm saying? That's what it is about in L.A. But you don't really too much, you know, see in school out here, oh, the blacks is, is fighting with the Hispanics right now. That You don't see that too much. You know, I'm not saying it never happened, it happened but rare when it's I was very, in, very when I was rare, in school, very I rare say in middle, LA. Middle school, uh, that shit happened probably twice. Yeah, yeah, it's more, it's more of the the gangs. What, where were you from? What set you from? It's more of that in LA. Yeah. You know, but uh, but no, nah, you said that. I said, yeah, only somebody from LA would understand that. You know, I saw Sean didn't really get it. Uh, but but when you you have to be from LA to understand that yeah, part. Because you know, you know, like if you go, if, if, we, if we from LA, but if you go to a whole, if you go to like a, a outskirt. One of these other little counties or, or uh, other cities in Los Angeles County, yeah. it's different. Yeah, yeah, it's way different. Yeah, no, that's a fact. That's definitely a fact. You know, to jump a uh, couple of topics and everything like that. For also, too, if we got anything else in the chat, Big Don, uh, let's read off what somebody got to say in the chat. Um, hey, did you um, I know, did you hear about? I, now I don't know if it's real or not. Hopefully, it's not, man, because nobody want to, you know, hear about that happening to anybody man but um did you hear about i guess blueface got severely beat in jail or yeah, something like yeah this? man i've been i've been i've been hearing um rumors of that but i can't like i ain't gonna lie like the little clips i heard i really can't take it too serious yeah i don't know i'm not saying it ain't i've been hearing some crazy shit yeah i heard one video where they said that he he landed in a dorm or i guess it was some schoolyards this is what i'm out of this allegedly this is just what they saying I, I don't know if this is real or not but this is some of the shit i heard and they say he landed in the dorm and there was some schoolyards i guess in there and um i guess they was tripping on him and saying he didn't get put on and he was living off his brother's name wow i mean i heard this but then i heard other shit and you know i heard they took off on him and shit or whatever um you know they was trying to say he his got own stabbed. people, his own his own crew. Basically. Yeah, but they yeah. probably was trying to pity him on. <laughs> you know, he got to get put on. <laughs> if that is the case. <laughs> oh man! And then you know he can't. It. He can't. They they probably like, dang, we can't. He you know he tall, big, and he box. Yeah, he's probably a challenge for. Yeah, I'm, I'm not saying for everybody because it people most of the people in there is working out yeah. every day. So, yeah. but he's still probably like. A challenge because boxing and street fighting is two different. Oh yeah. Things. Oh, it's definitely to a totally then different I heard, things, man. But then I street heard street fight anything goes. Yeah, but then I heard a, another situation that has something to do with a chain getting snatched, and I don't think that shit for real. Yeah. Where they got in jail? No, where it, it's shit been happening like three years ago, where his okay. chain got snatched in a, I guess like a something and it was with another community i heard about that actually yeah i think cowboy spoke on that too before so so yeah, yeah no, i heard about that yeah, yeah yeah and um they say it was like i don't know he's supposed to allegedly did something i don't know but they were saying so i i don't really i can't confirm it because i whack ain't said nothing about it at all well, if it did happen he you really wouldn't think that he gonna nothing. speak on it nah, yeah but nah. i but still i like, i haven't heard no I ain't heard no. It, it just ain't came from like a reputable um, source for me to go off of it or say anything really. Like, cause I ain't. 
the people that sign it, it ain't even I can't even take them serious. The clips that I'm getting sent. Yeah, yeah. These is pages that don't got no face. They <laughs> they sound like they don't know what they talking about and they just they saying some shit. But you know, they they be making people watch this type of shit. They saying some crazy shit. Yeah, like they yeah. saying, yeah, they were saying that he haven't got put on yet and they wanted to put him on and he got whooped on and man, people will say anything, man, to, to, to go viral. You know, you know how it is, man. You know, I I don't really that believe could be that. Some, I, I wouldn't believe that. I don't be believe some stuff that. His PR and, and the management got uh, Maybe. going on to keep I, I his just name. Don't, I just don't believe that this dude would, would, would rep that the way that he have repped it, you know, and, and how he rep it if he was lying about you know like one thing that we know man let's let's be real man when you come from LA maybe on the outskirts and other people do but people ain't really playing when they come down to that on YouTube you'll get on there and say anything lying about others whatever but when it come down to where you from your set and everything you know people is not really playing with that when it come down to just making up this is where I'm from you know I'm not saying it never happened but you don't really see that too much not not when it come down to people from LA you know, that's that's all I'm saying. It ain't. It's just not something that that's not common. So, <laughs> I'm not saying it never happened, Milk. I already know you got something going on up here, man. That's, that's like, hey, you know, I already know. <laughs> but I'm just saying it isn't, it isn't common. You. This is what I'm saying. I don't. I'm gonna be very honest with you. I'm not. I don't be sugarcoating shit like that. I be honest, bro. Blueface mama and him said that he was in the valley. I'm not saying he not crippled. Mama said a lot of stuff, man. Yeah, you really on. not listening to hold his, on. his mom he went, and them got to say. Hold on. He went to college and all this shit. You know, the the only reason that he even know about schoolyard more than likely is because his older brother was from schoolyard and he was in prison. Milk, where you be getting these stories from, this bro? This ain't no story. I promise, Milk. You just you be I'm like, you be having a book in your head and it got like a chapter to each book. Like, you know, no, I'm like, where did this come from? Because this is my this is what I do. So so it, I do reactions. You saying that it's information out there that that's that's saying all of this. It's videos, yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Uh, I mean, you just got I could come prepared with, with all this shit. I just didn't uh, come prepared, bro. I do, reactions. but you know, you also can't be listening. You know, it's a lot of videos and I'm stuff saying, out there. Man. No, I'm not talking about this recent shit. This recent shit is is new. I'm talking about videos that the mama did, that his brother then did, and all of this shit, bro. This is out here. I'm not even saying it's true or not, but I'm saying this. You is don't what, have haters in your family, milk. Yes, okay. but I'm trying to tell then you. You should you should understand yeah, what that's but about, still, bro. Okay, but come he on. still went to college and he was in he was in a whole nother state. This is what I'm trying to tell you. I'm not saying I'm taking nothing. Away from him. I'm not saying he in jail, PC, dub, not taking fades. I'm not saying none of that. That's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying what they said. That's what I you gotta you, hear. Man. That's what you gotta understand. I'm just saying when it comes down to family, when you the one yeah, who's the popular one, you making bread okay, and all of that. We already yeah, know how it go got, with the family, man. Yeah. You know, family going, hey, let me I can make me some bread. I can go some viral. Of shit let can me, be proven. I can get an interview. Whatever. Some of this shit can be proven though. Old clips yeah, of him I'm not being saying a football can't. a football <laughs> superstar. Yeah. I'm all that. This yeah. shit is documented, so that's not really up for discussion. But what I'm saying is this recent shit, I, I can't even, I don't know if that's real. I, I really don't believe it's real because I cannot, it's not been from a documented source for me. Yeah, These yeah. people that are saying this shit is kind of, I wouldn't, yeah. No, I feel but anything can happen. I'm going to tell you this, though. I'm not saying, I don't, I'm not going off none of that, but to say he can't get into nothing is wild. He, that's the county jail. Any, all I'm gonna say is anything can happen at to anybody. Yeah, it don't matter about the rapping or none of that shit. It do because you know certain people gonna you know because they want to mess with you. So when they get out, y'all could be like, oh, I know you, whatever. Whoop whoop, we was in the county. Yeah, shit like that, build a relationship. But other than that, that shit don't matter. You will still get whatever is gonna happen is gonna happen. Of course, everybody in survival mode, man. When they come down to you know that, man. So yeah, it don't it don't matter who you are, where you from, you know. Yeah. So, yeah. But uh, I don't believe I I can't go off of that shit. I'm telling you, because the shit, I, the clips that they send me uh -huh. is from channels that don't got faces, um, and they sound like they you can't even you don't know who they is, bro. So channels like that, I already don't, you know, I don't take um for nothing. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, they saying that shit, and then a Northanio YouTuber from yeah. like Sacramento, how you know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hey you, hey, you know what I want to uh, actually uh, uh, really quick as we get towards that. What, what are your thoughts on people who like do interviews and don't show their face? 
you know, like the way you just see, like, for instance, you're doing it. You did a lot of those type of interviews where, you know. Oh, you, were the it, people not there? They, 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 they talk and they're not there and it's just got you. What are your thoughts on those individuals who do interviews like that, man? Uh, is it is it is it kind of weird off to you? You think it's like something like a little bit wrong with them to want to do an interview like that? What are your thoughts on those dudes? I don't know, bro, because you got to think them was just interviews. It, it's not them wasn't wasn't podcast. Now I do understand. I feel like you know when people do interviews, maybe you should be because the first interview I ever did with uh, Big Hurt, he was there, mm. like in person. Like they came and you know did all the shit. Um, but yeah, you know, I don't know because maybe some people don't want to be on the camera. So I really don't know, bro. But I'm saying as far as these YouTube channels that you don't know who they are. Like if I could know who you is, maybe it's different because at least I can know who you, I know who you are. I don't know. To me, people who do interviews like that kind of come off insecure. I don't know, bro. It's like because why? Why? Why hide yourself? I mean, maybe you live in fear. I don't know. Like why hide yourself? Like. You don't feel you're important. You feel, I know some say, well, I want to make it all about them. It ain't never, not one time I didn't sit down here with an individual, you know, when we was just doing a straight interview with you or anybody, uh, uh, Michael Blackson, a big you, uh, 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 Rafi the Plug, where it wasn't about them. So, so I don't understand when I hear people say that. I don't want the focus to be on me because the focus is going to be on the person that you interviewing. Well, but to me, it, it kind of come off of your off as insecure and you're living in fear you 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 afraid of something you know like I, but it's just i just i just i just never understood that part you know I, I'm, I'm like look bro it yeah the interview is for someone else but you're important too why are you hiding you know what i'm saying i get it when you get big like a vlad or a sean cotton people know you too but bro like why 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 hide i don't i, don't, I never understood that you know what i'm saying because even when you see the greats you know, uh, um, do interviews, you know, uh, um, and everything like that. You've never saw, the, you know, the Arsenio Halls, the Jay Leno's. Like, when you see the greats, you never saw anybody behind a camera. You get what I'm saying? And just li just facing. It's weird anyway. Sometimes you even looked in a, a couple of interviews with you in the past. And it's just, you know, they ask you questions, you you know, facial expressions. And so like, why the camera on you right now? You ain't talking. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Milk, you know it's weird. Yeah, you know what I'm mean, saying. Shit. You got the person asking them question, it just them like, like waiting for the whole question to come out. Like that's weird, bro. But but no, nah, I just want to ask. I just want to get your thoughts on that. You know, I mean, they probably I, I they probably go have something to say to, about me for for mentioning that. But hey, I'm just being real. I, I don't just, understand those type of interviews. I just got something to say about the people that do the YouTube channels that you that speak on all the shit, but you don't know who they are. Now yeah. some of the channels. If they talking about the National Geographics and shit like that, you don't need to know who they are. They just narrating it. But these other channels that that be speaking on like Blueface getting yeah. attacked in jail and we don't know who you are, that is wild to me. Yeah, yeah. Because you could be like L.A. Um, PD. Yeah. So that that that's the weird part. But I mean, I don't know, bro. I, I don't even know who started that. I guess Vlad started that type of interview, huh? Was that like the very the, first one? He had. He been well, doing it for a minute. He liked the Godfather. To be yeah, honest, uh, if, uh, if of you that, be definitely. honest, of YouTube, of, intervie of, of you YouTube? interviewing YouTube, yeah. Nobody was uh, yeah, doing what, I, what I he him, did. I'm thinking about it. And I, it's been 16, yeah, uh, I give him that. 16 years, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he, because I remember, I, I, didn't, I didn't went and seen old videos where he was interviewing like uh, 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 Boosie, Webby, mm -hmm. and... Uh, when he was a DJ and shit. But this is the thing, though. I, I, this is why I, I don't understand that as well. Not just feeling like, hey, it's something more personal going on on why somebody do an interview like that, but also... Well, they, you're probably right. Look, they don't want nobody it, it's to, some, to, it's to something know who deep. It, it's something deeper than that, bro. I, I think it's something deeper. You know, like, I, I study a lot of times the minds. I'm very observant. So uh, it's something deeper going on when somebody feel it's not just about money. It's not about I want to make it all about them. It's something deeper going on because you're going to the extra. You're going an extra level to make sure that you're not seen on something that's going to be or, seen by the masses. It's something more going on. Maybe it's a but, safety precaution. But but also well, well no because if somebody really want to find you, bro, like come on if it's that serious. But 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 also too, I look at it like this. Like when I saw a Vlad interview with G Herbo, I like that's my favorite. Not G Herbo. Um, 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 ah, 
G Herbo, G Herbo boy, what's his name? The one who um, Bibby. Bibby, there we go. When I saw his interview with Lil Bibby, to me that's the best interview I saw Vlad do. That's my favorite interview from Vlad. And you was able to see Vlad during that interview. Yeah. I love that interview. I'm like, man, Vlad, do your interviews like this, bro. Like, why are you behind the screen and we see it? You asking somebody a long question and you chopping it up and you just see the person uh, looking at the guy, uh, you know, laughing. Like, bro, it's, it, it's weird to me, right? It's weird. Bro, everybody. I, now, though, let me be honest. Most of the interviews where the person is, is not seen who's interviewing, I'll just listen to it. I don't even want to because it's weird when you're not talking. The camera just pointed at you. And you, you know, you don't know, you can't, you ain't, you making facial expressions and no. it, it's just on you. It's like, I'm just staring at the person in their eyes. I don't want to look at nobody, no, no grown man in the eye. He not even talking. Ain't no reason to look at you him. Interview so, so I'm just saying, I, I would rather just listen to those interviews. I don't even want to look at them. You get what I'm saying? Nah, I it's mean, cause look, weird. bro, you interview Aries Spears, right? Yeah. The own the way I found out about him was through Vlad. Yeah. His, his interviews. Yeah. Did is, that shit is hilarious to me. Yeah, yeah. Um, but but, but you can't say that it wouldn't have been better if Vlad was involved in the interview. Yeah, it would have been. It probably, probably been, been even better, better. More views, all that shit. That's probably. all I'm saying. Yeah, maybe. You know, but hey, maybe. Every, what I be saying be making sense, man. It's just that people. Don't it's just I speak on. But it. maybe it. everybody don't want the the attention. But if people want to know you, because bro, that, that ain't going to do anything but different for you in your life. Yeah, because once hold you hold start up. getting subscribers, what's they get ho what's homie name? What's homie name? That was from Chicago who got killed. Was never putting himself. Sean Cotton was cool with him. I forget he his name. He was doing some shit. So you know what I'm talking about, yeah, right? he was in some shit. Okay. Zach TV. Zach TV. Yeah. You never saw Zach. Never. But he was outside, though. Wait, Milk. You never saw Zach, though. But Zach got murdered. The only thing that I'm saying is that that part don't matter. You could think that if somebody really wanted to catch somebody who saying something stupid or crazy no. behind the camera, they going to catch you. No. So that's all it, I'm saying not, is that that don't mean nothing. It's not about them saying nothing stupid or, or nothing. It's about the attention. People probably don't want that. You not understanding it. What attention? They don't want people coming up to them. They probably, Vlad got a lot of following on Instagram. He you probably know, didn't. Now want, you know people I mean, know not Vlad, Instagram. Bro. People uh, know Vlad. Yeah, but not at first. I didn't know who he was at first. No, not at first. I but didn't. I'm saying. But I'm saying. It took but, me but, a but while if you to, wanted to, to even Google, I didn't even know you could Google his face. But bro. I was. That's what I was gonna say. But if you wanted to know Vlad or see Vlad, you could find Vlad. Well, I didn't know that, and yeah. a lot of people didn't. Nobody. I didn't know that. I when I first heard him, I would have swore he was black. I didn't know. I didn't I know. Never, I never. When I I never thought that Vlad was black. I never I, thought I Vlad was black. I did not know that he was. I That's did, interesting. I never thought Vlad shit, was black. I didn't. I didn't. I think, mean, I could hear his voice and tell that he's not black. I, don't I can't. Know. I can't personally. I Me, I can't. You know what I'm, I'm saying? I'm just saying. It's bro, just a different tone. I he, never thought Vlad was black. I, I never seen him at first. When I started watching the videos, I never seen him. Once I seen him, I was like, "Whoa, this is Vlad." Yeah, this crazy I mean, like I didn't, I didn't, I wasn't thinking he was Russian and all this other stuff, but I didn't think he was black. I, I, I thought he was like a, you want me to be real? <laughs> I'm always being real. I thought it was like a Vanilla Ice white boy. No, that's what I, I thought. That from vanilla, that's what I felt when I heard his voice. Like a Vanilla Ice. That's that's what I felt from Vlad's voice. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah, without or, seeing. Nah, him. I would, cause I would have maybe he could have been like one a suburb, like been been born in the suburbs, bro. I don't know. I just didn't know. It was a complete shock to me when I seen him. All right. I feel you on, but, but you see, you showing he show he show his face now. Yeah, when he you know he going on interviews, he yeah. going on other people's interviews and everything. So eventually, people want to show their face or want to be seen and all this type but of stuff. But I believe in the in the beginning, I just believe people are just being insecure. You know, I think it's more about oh, I don't know what this is going to turn out to be or whatever. It's just a lot of insecurities and fear of what the people may think. Or that's he what did I it. look, bro. I go deep. Or he I go did deep it. With this. Or he did this it. This has nothing to do or with nothing else. It. Trust me. Or he did it and then it started working and he just kept doing it. Yeah, I'm not saying where it, it didn't end up going. I'm just saying that it was deeper issues in the beginning for people to do interviews the like peop that. But the people that do the, the you describing the people too that make the channels mm -hmm. that talk about all the shit that we have all these subscribers, but we don't know who they are. Why do you have yeah. a YouTube channel? I mean, it's cool because you can probably make money, but what's the point of having? A million, two million subscribers, and you don't know, you can't even really tell nobody. Yeah, I mean, that's a whole don't most of those people they cap in, they, like they just trying to make hood? money. They, you, you know, that's that a whole hood? other thing. You ever seen that hood? Uh, I think it's hood politics. Have you ever came across that? Probably, man. They got I'll like, a, they, a lot they got of, like a half you know, a million 
subscribers and they, and they be popping huh they be talking about the uh they 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 talk about cases that happen yeah, and shit yeah. but that's a person that's talking about he's going to get cases mm -hmm. for murders and shit gang murders and everywhere in la some people say he's see but that's different i can understand why that person not putting their face yeah but why you know, would you want to you know i'm talking about that people shit, that though. do interviews you know that's that's a whole different thing you doing an interview man you know, like it's something deeper going on there because there's no reason to not be a part of the interview when you're doing the interview. You are kind of there, though. Make no sense. You kind of there. <laughs> you know, I mean, it you is what it like, is, bro. I mean, right hey, they, they make, you know, the Vlads, the Cam Capones, the Art of Dollar, they all making money. So it is what it is. I just, but some from people, day one when I seen that, I just always thought that was weird. I'm but like, some what? people, some people probably, look, I'm telling you, I'm just, I'm just thinking about everything. Some people probably, you're right, they probably in fear. Maybe they yeah, don't want to get nowhere close to nobody. Maybe. Of course. So yeah. they like, let me just pay somebody to go pull up to a studio or something and interview the people. So I understand you. If I did interviews, I would rather be standing or sitting next to the uh, the people. Yeah, you a part of it, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know. Um, yeah, no, I understand that, but I'm just saying like you gotta, you you know like some people have different motives when they do that shit. I don't know. You know, I can't tell you. Like, yeah. I have did one like an interview when I first started and I wasn't in the um interview. And tell me how weird it was doing it was an interview weird. like that. It Thank was, you. It was. Thank you. That's all I'm and saying. And the only reason I did it because I was new and I and I shouldn't have been trying to do this shit, but I had somebody come and I tried to interview him and I didn't know if the camera was going to be right and when I pressed it I just stood like back there and did it, but yeah. I didn't the next interview cuz I only did like 3 interviews, but the okay. next two was um or the next 3 cuz I had interviewed like Big Sad and Yellow Hill too, so that added but, oh okay. You interviewed Yellow Hill. Yeah, that was a, up. that was a long time ago. Yeah. But yeah, so I I started sitting kind of in the interviews. But yeah, like I just wasn't into that shit. I just was doing the reactions. That yeah. was just hitting for me. But yeah. yeah, bro, I don't I don't know, bro. I just I feel you because I don't I don't I, yeah I feel the same way, bro. I just feel that toward more towards the people who do them type of channels mm -hmm. and speak on all that shit and they're not showing their face. Yeah, yeah. I can't stand that shit, Loki. I mean, I'm not hating on them if they feeding a situation yeah yeah no that's a fact you know do what you got to yeah, do you know especially I, like, if I just, you from the nah, especially you, if you from the uh the like the ghetto yeah i always say no, no no matter what make your make your bread i'm just calling it out i'm just you know speaking on it but nah make your you making money you do what you got to do hey great job you know whatever you know so uh maybe yeah maybe they do feel like insecure about their looks Maybe they that's what like i'm saying there's more to it it's more to it bro you know it people i don't know they could be you know you ain't just coming up hey i want to do an interview and sit behind the camera yeah like huh. it just don't make no sense you know but yeah man uh hey you know what i want to ask you before you know we get out of here man um what's what's, what's going on with your i know last time we, when you was here with the last couple of times you know we talked about you know uh your faith you know and everything and um you know, you you even spoke. You even said, you know what you said, Bill. You even said you want to start getting more into going to church and things like that. You know, so where yeah. where you at with that? You know, I'm I'm gonna ask about that uh, because I'm I'm a, I'm a, I'm a Christian man and I'm always speaking on faith. So I want to ask you, where you at with that, Milk? I mean, I ain't I ain't even gonna lie to you. You praying? Church. You in your Bible? You reading your Bible, Milk? I, I'm not even gonna lie to you. I haven't touched the Bible and not the church, but I don't I don't do nothing bad. I do all good shit. I, I don't. <laughs> I'm a good person, like a human. Uh, all that shit, I, I put good energy out in in the real world. Um, Y'all don't do no bad. I think about anything that I'm about to do or anything like that. So I don't really. If, as far as like shit like that, yeah. I mean, I ain't. I haven't did wrong in a long time. If I hit you up one Sunday and say, "Milk, trying to you know want to want to roll to church," you gonna roll? Yeah, it just depends where the church is. <laughs> yeah, well, gonna, you know me. You know yeah. I'm not going. You know I. You know how I move. I'm just you know saying, what I'm saying? You know, I, I ain't like you ain't see. No, you don't uh, see me at these events and moving around with everybody. Like you know, it's you know I I, I move a little bit different. So you yeah, know, I don't want to be. I know. I, you know, it just we ain't I'm going just, to the. We ain't I'm going to. I, I, you, look, look, and it nothing wrong with it because I I used to go to um West Angeles. You know, right there off of Crenshaw, but yeah, no, I don't, I don't I go there no more. You know what I'm saying? So church i go to is you know what i'm saying it's you know so but yeah like i'm not against that i ain't no uh, all right i'll meet you up one time i'll meet you up one saturday a milk hey i'm gonna pick you up we going to church you know what i'm saying i used to go to i mean i used to go to church when i was younger bro like i used to i grew up in the household when we was young we used to go to church and or 
I ain't say I went every day, but we used to go to church and my grandma or whatever. And then like every, you know, every Easter, Christmas, e- I mean, Christmas or and all that. We yeah. At church. Yeah. For sure. Like all that, all that type of stuff. But One thing that I will tell people, and, and I myself got to, you know, be reading more. You know, I'm always busy, so don't get to read the way I want to read. One thing I will tell people out there who just trying to gain wisdom and, and really figure out what they trying to do in life and grow. Trust me, read Proverbs. I don't know if you know about Proverbs, but Proverbs is the book of wisdom. You know what I'm saying? You know, like a lot of times, look, the things that can help us grow, we overshadow that. We rather pay attention to somebody who, like we was talking about, somebody who could lead you to hell that 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 is mentally challenged in all type of ways. They need therapy. In fact, they need to be in some some home where 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 people is watching them 23 hours out of the day they need to be in stuff like that people are paying attention and following to those individuals but things that can help you actually grow and and, and become successful like y'all want to become you know uh, uh, uh looking at y'all want to look at people who got money but don't want to understand what it take to really get it yeah. when people give wisdom when it come down to how you could get to those places you don't want to listen you know you know I'm, I, bro let me tell you this milk and I do it purposely. I'll have clips where I'm straight up just talking. I'm giving you the blueprint on exactly what I did on how I just made, let's say, 50 grand on getting one truck on the road. I'm giving you the steps. I'm laying it out. I'm telling you from A to Z. I'm even saying, write me. I'm going to tell you if you're doing the right thing or, or not, right? That clip would have about 900 to 1,000 views. But guess what? I cut up a clip where... I'm talking about Brick Baby or somebody talking about this person or that person or Milk getting on this person or whatever. 10K plus is gone. It's out of here. Yeah. And it's like, hold up. That's the part that I would never, ever get because it's like y'all all want to become successful. Y'all all say y'all want to be, you know, you know, rich and be able to take care of your family and y'all want to get out of poverty. But you are mainly paying attention to the stuff that have nothing to do or anything that's going to help you in your life. And I can speak on this. And people still going to watch the, the, the clips that I put out there that I just want to get numbers and make money on. Because half of the clips that's like that, I'm going to be real. I tell you all the truth. I'm just trying to make some bread with that clip. You get what I'm saying? I'm trying to hit a quota every month as well. Yeah. Right? So, hey, I want to mainly put out there what I'm doing that can help you grow. But people ain't watching that. So you gotta hit you gotta put out your clips that make your quota. All right. I'm gonna put out this. I'm gonna put out five of these this week. Now you understand my life. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Imagine that you understand me now. You already know what it is, and I, man. I, man. Bro, I'm shit. I didn't I figured that out already. It's fucked up. Yeah. It's yeah. reality. It's reality. So you gotta it is you gotta up, get you know? yourself in a better position with this. As best as you could, with as neutral, mm-hmm. and then you can do better with your resources that you get. That's a fact. It take a lot of work, though. What people yeah. understand, because a lot of people said to me, like, "Man, won't you talk more about this or talk more about that?" For one, I'm like, "Well, why don't y'all watch more of that then? If y'all telling me to talk more about it, <laughs> like you telling me to talk more about it, but y'all be watching it. Nah. You know, y'all. When I see y'all, y'all telling me about, man, this person did this or what, what milk really this or what hell or this. Y'all telling me about that, but the stuff about business, you telling me to talk more about it when y'all not watching it. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. So, so." You're right. What people don't understand is that it's hard to survive on YouTube unless you have collaborations in, 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 in um, how can I say it? Collaborations, of course, consistency, and a little bit of chaos when it comes down to your channel. And what I mean by chaos, controversy. You know, you gotta, if, when you first getting in, those things gotta be elements to your channel if it's gonna grow. Now, I'm not saying that you can't keep it all positive and maybe 20 years later you don't have a channel that got 100K. I'm not saying you can't get no subs. I'm just saying if you're trying to have your channel grow and you got a message you're really trying to put out there, you got to do certain things too that you may not always want to do, but it's going to help your channel get to where it needs to get to. So then, like you said, you could get to the point one day to where now you can put more of what you're trying to give back yeah. to, to, to others. You, you know what I'm saying? You know, you got to get there first though. And the you're not going to get it. there doing it that way. The news, look what they do. Of course. They do it. They trying to get the top story, you know? They put the most craziest shit on there. And then they put little good videos. But yeah. you know, the only shit that really get the views is the... 
Yeah. You know, the controversy. It's that's just, a it's fact. Crazy. The controversy. But that's just how it go, bro. Yeah, but, yeah. Um, you just run it up. I mean, figure it out, run it up. And it's like, don't get on me when you ain't at home watching TBN all day. Yeah. Like, you anything. ain't, don't get on me. You know, like, yeah, you I'm trying to put positivity to out into the world. But when you go home, you watching reality shows, you watching uh, uh, the ID channel, you watching Forensic Files, Bro, you, you watching positive. Channel 11 News, but you want to tell me that I'm over here, you know, putting out this and putting out that and I should put more of this out. Well, you go home and watch TBN all day and then come and tell me that a month after watching TBN all day and all night. And then I'll say, you know what? You're right. You're right. But until that happened, man, you know, it's reasons on why. We do the things that we do when it comes down to our channels. And it's reasons on why we put out certain things. And people just need to understand that part of it, you know. But when it comes down to it, I would prefer to put out stuff that could just show you how to build and grow your business. And, and stuff that is dealing with just straight up positivity, you know, and nothing but that. But I also want to give people the real. I want to keep it real. If this is what Milk is going through and what Milk is feeling, I want Milk to talk about that. Keep it real, you know. So it is what it is. Bro, I did a video, like a short video, giving 34 blankets away to the shelter. That Five shit views. didn't get no views. <laughs> to this day. That's sad, man. That's sad. That's sad, yeah. bro. I feel you. You know, I feel you. That's crazy. That's the way it is, you know? So. But if I go get a video standing somewhere and, and, and hit a blunt saying something, it's going to, you know, like. Oh, yeah. It's going to get views. Hit a blunt and talk about how G-Face is lying. Yeah. It'll just go crazy. It's going crazy. Anything. Like, it's yeah, just. Yeah. But if you go do some shit like that. <laughs> no views. None. <laughs> it's crazy. I feel you. You know. I, I'm not even going to lie to you, bro. Been through it's it, bro. It's crazy. Yeah. I'm like, so if I do do that shit, that shit, I'll just be doing it as whatever. But, yeah, it's crazy. C-Mac mastered it because he do it like, he still like. Five five, he's still yeah. game banging and this and shit, and you know he's just doing something extra with it. Yeah. So that's how he do it. But if you just doing that shit, you gotta do more like pranks. Or if I think if you do it long enough, it'll start catching. Um, it'll traction. start catching up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eventually, or you once you get big enough, that percentage that's watching that shit will still be. Um, yeah, because they just want to see what you're doing. You get to a point where people just want to see what you're doing. Yeah. No matter what, you could be just looking in the camera doing absolutely nothing. Yeah. You Still know, so, base. yeah, yeah, you got to have that fan base, so. But, yeah, they, they, this world is crazy, bro. They don't, they don't, it, yeah. they talk that positive shit, but yeah. it don't sell. Yeah, no, nah, I, I mean, it don't, it don't, man, so. All right, Milk, man, we're going to get out of here, man. What you got coming up, though, man? Let the people know what Milk is going to be doing, what Milk got coming up, man. You know, just in case it's another month before you up in here. What is Milk going to be doing in the next couple of weeks? What Milk got coming up? What is Milk working on? Oh, bro, probably I, I'm really working on some skits right now. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Okay. About to do some skits. Um and that's probably it right now. Like No, no, you finish milk. Uh when we uh after milk finish, I, I do wanna I'm glad you put that up. I wanna read any new chats or anybody chats. I wanna make sure we get to all of that. But uh my bad, milk. You go back there. Yeah, no, nah, I'm just I'm probably about to do some skits and upload that. And I really been like on the edge of doing a music video, For like real? a song and a music video. Okay, you yeah. got some. You you got music you put out. Uh, I did a song before, like a long time ago, okay. in 2012. It's on SoundCloud, but it ain't really. It was just like a freestyle type song with one of my uh, homies. But you got the platform. Uh, Why yeah, not that's do what it? I was saying. I got the platform, so I could just do that shit, whatever, and upload it on my uh, channel. Yeah. Whatever it do, it do. But yeah, just something like that, and uh. Continue to just do what I do and uh, just push it more. That's yeah. basically it. Get back really to like uh, all type of different shit, you know. Um, Thanks. Yeah, bro. And just keep pushing. I don't know. Like if you – to me, I, I'm, I'm not getting comfortable. But like when you kind of get that notch, you kind of got to let it turn a little slow a little bit and get all of the shit mm -hmm. and then speed up a little bit. Yeah. But, yeah, uh, so right now, shit, yeah, the same shit, and then, but basically, like, the biggest thing, probably, I might, like, I, I've been trying to look for a location, I think I found one, but I probably start doing, like, a little podcast type of thing, Okay. maybe, you know, but other than that, shit, same shit, push more vlogs and skits, really. Yeah, yeah. That's really it, though. That's what's up. Probably music videos, to be honest, because I've really been um, thinking about that. 
though. Yeah, just to do it, really. Cause I Why got not, the man? Yeah, yeah. When you got your own platform, try it all out, man. You know, so you never know what your 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 base is going to really attach on to, you know, so just, you know, put it out, see where it go. Yeah, and me? it ain't so. really, you know, it ain't, it's not really, like it cost a lot to really do a um, song in a uh, Oh, nowadays? Video. Yeah, nowadays, nah, man. Nothing. You know, even for the little uh, intro that I got, man, me and Big Don was out there just doing our thing. It was me and Big Don. Huh, Big Don? Ain't that right, Big Don? Yes, show you, Big hey, show you, show the people, man. Big Don, you was out there with me. Ain't that right, Big yeah, Don? Man, just us making it happen. <laughs> Really? You know, shoot, you know, you know, nowadays you can you can make it happen like that. So you're right, you know. Just Bro, I seen most of the music videos I seen were shot off a of, uh, iPhone. Oh yeah. I mean, that dude, what's his name? If I'm mistaken, Lyric Lemonade. He be using iPhone. Shoot, all Keep Chief early videos was off. Yeah, I think Take K a few. Take K all of them. Yeah. <laughs> shoot, going viral. Shoot. Yeah. Camera I, good enough. Yeah. Right. Right. All right, let's uh, check out the rest of the chat before we get out of here, Big Don. Make sure that we show everybody respect and, uh, you know, read the rest of the chat. It was just one man. Oh, just one? Posted. All right, for sure. Read it off. Uh, Center 24, I'm sure those people appreciate those blankets. It get cold that night. That's a fact. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I wasn't and that's, that's what it. And that's what it... And I think that what they said is that. And at the end of the day, that's really what it's really about, though. Yeah, you know, like, no, yeah, wasn't... yeah, people don't be on a positive... Positivity and but people, them, though, people right? want positivity in their life, but that ain't what attracts people's eyes. Hell no. You get what I'm saying? But you know, uh, uh, but he was right. At the end of the day, that's what matters the most, though. Yeah, yeah. You know, so I, I plan to do, I plan to do a lot of stuff, low key. Yeah. I just ain't, I ain't just wrote up the like a plan yet. Yeah, the script. But, yeah. But, yeah, the script. But it's in the works though. That that ain't really nothing. I wouldn't got them. Um, I ain't got. They was cheap. Good mm. blankets, brand new. But, you know, they didn't really cost that much. And mm. I was supporting other people when I got them because I'm pretty yeah. sure they ain't selling them like that. Yeah. Where Facts. I got them at. Facts. Man, well, you know, we got another one in the book, Smilk. You know, any last words, bro? Man, just tell them to keep pushing. and Keep uh, pushing. That's pretty. Do something. Yeah, don't, yeah. don't just sit around. Man. And if you got kids, take care of them. Facts, facts, man. Stop sitting around. Yeah, yeah. Um, a lot of people be they be trying to get on YouTube and they ain't even taking care of their um their kids, bro. Man. Yeah. 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 I mean, that's that's. And all if day. I gotta be hated, cause I cause I pitch something out about somebody like that, then I'll be hated. Cause yeah. it is what it is. But it's a lot of people, bro. I'm telling you, that's that's all I be telling them. Like they hate on me, but they don't take care of their kids. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's like, a fact. Yeah, but it, it's crazy. That's all I'm saying. Like keep pushing. Uh, take care of their kids and um, do something with they self. Stop yeah, yeah. sitting around. Yeah, facts, facts. Not. Yeah. Yeah. And you Appreciate did hit a hundred k. Yeah, I did hit a hundred k, man. God, ah, hundred k in the bag, man. You know what I'm saying? I ain't saying nothing until we get a million. We got the hundred k. You know what I'm saying? So At least we you did. gonna get your plaque, yeah. huh? <laughs> At least you're going to get your plaque. Hopefully, I haven't even looked into that yet. Should they probably already sent them. Probably sent since them, uh, you know? I haven't even looked into that at all, bro. I haven't been on, you know, even thinking about any of that, um, bro. You but need to go think about it. Yeah, yeah, check it out, you know. Yeah, Put it yeah. right here, boom. Bam. Black on the wall. Yeah. <laughs> all right, man, it's your boy, Paul P. You got milk, big Don in the building. We yeah. out of here. Love you all. Doses. <laughs> Up in the ring, my eye on the mission. That Olympian soldiers right here was my vision. Make it to the top, catch everyone's attention. The haters they can hate as long as they listen to the words that I say as my tongue keeps twisting. Heavyweight flow, you not in my position.